Okay. I press the shortcut for the music to stop. I mean, I mean like stop after play pack. Why did it not work? I I hate it. Okay, so like oh, today is gonna be a great day. Just 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 looking like this. Crap! I am capturing not the wrong SL. This is a great day. This is this is oh, this is a great day. Uh -huh -huh -uh -huh -huh. This is a great actually knowing to check this interface. Ah, let please cooperate. Uh, yeah, recently I learned that Netherlands is quite a messed up language. Uh, window mode. <laughs> no, it's not gonna update. So, crap. So many different translations. Like, SL does not expect. For you to have so many languages installed. I'm gonna have to restart real quick. Uh crap, scenes. Okay. Uh, uh, uh I need to go to Discord, I need to ping everyone that I exist and uh, because I am an important man. Crap. Stream ping. I'm live. Ah oh crap, the link. Publish, publish. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, now music. Also, how how do I? Yes, I need to unmute this. Okay, music. I need to make this a little bit quieter. And now we go to. <coughs> Works. Uh -huh. Okay, time to restart the cell. And this weird thing happened like recently where I would just start a cell and it would just stop. And I was just like, wait a second, I clicked that. Because like I, I would launch a cell and do something else and it would just like close on itself. Thanks, a cell. A cell is such an unstable game. But more like on computer, it's not, you know, like many people have different experiences with this. But for me, like, it never was really that unstable. What is unstable is when I need to play it on a Steam Deck. Oh, this is, this is looking like a terrible day. Uh, this, is, this is really frustrating. For the love of UK. I need to unfavorite these ones because I hate them. What? Huh? Only one active. What happened? Well, oh yeah, I clicked this one. I mean, hold up, let's look at the... Where is the... Where is the handle for the scroll thing at the bottom? What's going on? What? What is, what is going on? What is going on? Okay, I have no clue what's happening. Uh, crap. US or something like that. Chaos Fury. Oh, this is gonna be a bad stream. I swear, there is... Either I have dementia, like seriously, this is the... Another thing where I'm complaining about this, why is there so little SL servers? It's summer, people should be playing this game, come on! I think we're gonna have to manually scroll, find something, because we cannot just choose the language that we speak. Na 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 na, na na na, a ruse. No. No, no, Russian, Russian, Russian. Uh, Russian, ra no, Russian, 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 Russian. Oh, that's not Russian. China, 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 China. No. 
No servers, actually no servers. Okay, I have no clue. How do other people play this game? You know what? Fight? Full games? No, we're gonna do it full games. UK. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe I'm just not looking for full games. No, never mind. UK is dead. UK fell off. Okay, we're gonna try this one. It's a bit frustrating because every single time I stream, I cannot find a server to play on. And the problem is, like, when I play on my own time, I play on Polish servers. Still, mate, we'll look at that. Goddamn. What? Uh, what? <laughs> I'm a spectator. But I play on Polish servers. So when it comes to play on stream, where I need to speak the English language... Imagine using fast restart, that's so cringe. Although it was quite fast, wow. Yeah. Because SL is so much about like... If you want to have fun in SL, you need to find a community you enjoy playing in. Time to go blow up. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. So, when I need to choose one from one of the central servers, because they are the ones that... People play. Because um, everything else is just empty. Down. It's just... Ah, you know. Hey, mother. Wait, no. What? No. <laughs> Don't oh, enable well, the well, machine. Well. Hello. Sorry about him. He's just a bit. Oh. Oh. Ooh, hoo, hoo. oh okay. He almost killed you. Hey, uh, sail. W. Sail. Oh. Attention. W. I have bullets if you want to kill this guy. Why would you want to kill me? Where? Yeah, there's a gun. Oh, I'm gonna grab it. Right, become a scientist. Get in the machine. I'm very fine. What? You're gonna become a scientist. You're telling me I'm war, so you need to put me on fine to become a scientist. Yep. I'm gonna see what happens with these. Would you look at that? Did someone, uh, did someone bullets, piss you outside of the door? Yeah, okay, never mind. Boop, boop. I think Wait, I'm gonna go. I got a Janet card. Nooty. And you are not me. Peanut? Nah. Literally not even in the game. W? Oh, hello. This is not a peanut. Come in! Jesus. Jesus! You say, remind you. Jesus? Hey, Zeus! Like the guy the from from being God? Yeah. It's not possible, so I speak French. I speak French. Bonjour. How do you say it? That is not English. This is truly so sad. I'm not French, bro. I'm, I'm English. Why don't people just like join? Okay. Actually, no. Hi, how are you? Good. If you're about to like recommend me some service about like, oh, would you like to have bots watch your stream because you're so pathetic? Please do the word. Please click this. <laughs> That's how they begin every single time. Okay, if you're a normal person. Thanks. Well, that's what I am doing. I know. <laughs> that's why it's funny. Oh, the British. A 
Have you got a gun? No. Actually, I was a dickhead, but I was forced to, I don't know, change professions. Oh. I didn't even know you I know, I know there's a bunch of uh, other like scientists and uh, facility guards coming, so you can either escape and try cuffing me, so I, then I can escape, or... No, 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 you cuff me, you cuff me, go, go, okay. go. I'll wait here. Oh, the British people, they ca they couldn't hurt you, even if they tried. Ooh, oh, new cars. cars. Run. There you go. I'll take this. I quite like it. Mmm. Mmm. Well, no, I think we should go in. Oh, that's gotta be. Man, you all suck. Man, how did the STPs die? Nice. You try and charge me phone. The timer. I did this weird thing where I just charged my phone oh, shit. to 50%. No, it's you, fat dog! And then when it gets you to 20, one. hi, hello. No, who's hey, sir, you must not get to 20, dog, I... Hi, Twitch, hi, Twitch. Wait, you're live on Twitch? Yeah. <laughs> Someone said you're live. I'm gonna spit him. Well, that just happened. Well, that just happened. Very scooby though I'm not following someone who's gonna close doors on me every five seconds. scooby is coming here, I don't like that. Mm hmm How would you look at that? How would you look at this? This is... Perfect. Why do I have this? And why do I have ammo? Ah! Attention, all persons. Why would you follow? Do you hate me? You actually want me to get a heart attack. And screw you. I'm gonna thank you for following. Piss off. I'm follow on one more account. Why? What is the point? Lad, I, the numbers don't give me anything. Oh my god, I thought you are fat fire. Oh damn, does it? I have a gun for some reason. No, I ha have a gun. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> oh, I don't have a keycard. Crap. Yes. Oh, Make something interesting. Oh. Okay, goodbye. Bye bye. Hey, could you give me that gun back? I have two bullets. No, no, you should have put them fine. Put them fine. Okay. Oh. Bang, 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 bang. So now I'm gonna get a grenade. Now I paid all this cell. Flashbangs are crap. I don't care. Right. Why? Right. Great. I'll not. I'm not gonna touch it. You can okay, touch I'm it. Okay, I'm gonna touch it. You guys get it. I'll fix it. Man, I have such a trolling device in my hand. <laughs> you do. Is there friendly fire on this server? Yes. Sir. Sir. Ah! Okay, thank you. You are mean. How did that happen? Get your bitch out of here. Get your bitch what? ass out. Hey, Sigmers. Hey, Sigmers. Hey, Sigmers. How, how oh, did you. You know what, whatever. Is there a point of questioning this? Terrible, bad. Oh, hello. How's it going? How did you? You know what? Whatever. Oh, hello.
Thank you for whoever that was. <laughs> ah, my stuff is so crap. I cannot. I. Ah, it's so difficult to see anyone. Ah, I'm not winning that username. Piss off. Skibidib. Skibidib to Eliator Creeper. Yeah, we Man, this is old. I had a talk with one of my friends about like what these words actually mean. And honestly, I think m most people that actually say these things on a regular. Sorry, the brain rot language, as it is called officially. Like, they probably don't know what these words mean anyway. So I managed to get myself a second mouse. It's like a wireless mouse, because I need one for my laptop. Because I'm gonna get a laptop, by the way. Finally, I won't have to boot up SL on a Steam Deck when I need to record something for a video that requires two people. You have no clue how annoying it is to run SL on a Steam Deck. I'm more like, you know, it's fine. But when there is an update, holy, you just launch it, random error, and you can't even, like, close it because Steam, and, you know, you need to you reboot the device. I'm not listening to you. You need to reboot the device and uh, then uh, you need to reinstall. Sometimes validating doesn't work. You need to reinstall SL. And that thing is. Okay, it's not verified, but it says it's playable. Go to Task Manager. Linux! On a Steam Deck! SL on a Steam Deck! What manager? I don't have a keyboard, I don't have a mouse. What am I supposed to do? Linux tech tip. Have you heard about the man? Well, that's unfortunate. Get with the. It's a Steam Deck! With 64 gigabytes! Uh, Oh, why do I have this gun? I'm probably going to cause hearing damage, that's bad. Sadly, uh, there's a light on it there. I'm not going I'm getting out of there. I, I, I am throwing away my radio. I'm not I even trying. I have caused it. I have caused it. We gotta run. My ears are actually hurting. Because if you didn't know when I get locked in the microphone. I hear it too. Wait, you hear what? Wait for me. When I get loud on my microphone, I hear the loudness as well, so I have to hear it as painful as everyone else. It's nice. Horrible. One out of three generators acted and detonated. By the way, I think I've just broken Matty's expensive headphones. Yippee. I can do the hyper DP sound, sorry. My photo actually implode. What server? This server? I don't know. The only not full UK server that isn't Dr. Bright Facility, thank you very much, that I could find. I swear this probably not gonna even be that good. My main problem with I wonder how this got here. <laughs> Five minutes. Yes, thank you. Huh. There shouldn't be SCPs in light containment, right? I mean, right? We're gonna get ourselves the new cola. Unless the game will decide to randomly throw 27 SCPs at me again.
IX CD. Yeah, that's 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 me when I want to play music on car. Got them. By the way, my car doesn't have a headphone jack, which hurts me quite a lot. I need to actually burn CDs. Ridiculous. <laughs> On one hand, cities are cool. On the other hand, no. Why does this exist? Okay, whatever. We're gonna put this on one to one. Ew, would you look at that? I'm gonna take that. Oh, and this. Mm. I'll even get the, the, they, oh no, crap. I think there's like customers recipes on this server because I put a, Flashbang earlier, or actually, maybe not. You know what? I don't know. Like, I've. I don't know many 914 recipes, to be quite honest. We don't play with soundboard. Yeah, go on. It's the beginning of a sentence. If you don't play with some cheap viewers, oh, there we go. Yeah, that's a scam. Trash game with no soundboard. See, I would agree with you. But it's more like... 90% it's trash. And it takes... Like... Time, or just luck. To find that 10% and know how to get it consistently. From the amount of spectator, as I see, spectating me, I bet that I am the only one alive. This is not good. Like one of the last people alive. Or maybe I'm just amazing, I don't know. Maybe you just like me. I'm cool. Yeah. These, att these attachments suck. Then I can just go on server list, disable every and empty and not empty server, and you will get the name. SCP successfully terminated. Termination calls unspecified. Yeah, yippee! To be honest, I've never expected a universe where anti-cola would be overpowered and normal cola would be considered terrible. But alas, that's what Norfolk gave us and we have to work with what we get. I have a menace would do this. Uh -oh. There we go. SCPs never recontain themselves unless they have a terrible Wi-Fi provider. Wi-Fi provider, internet provider, ah, whatever, you know what I'm saying. Chaos spawned, well, you know, I guessed. Guessed by the announcement, you know? And by the amount of spectators that suddenly disappeared. Because that's one, then where are they? Running on the nuke would be quite silly.
to like make them scatter. And first, I need to get to a workstation anywhere for the love of. No one's gonna come here. Thank you, thank you. Actually, that, that ammo... Wow! I saw a laser dot on the ground. So it's like crap, they know I'm here. I closed the door, but I was just like, oh, now they know that I'm here even more. They said, you know what, screw it. What server? How many times do I need to show this? SCP Lockdown 1. You cheeky guy. I know what you are. Yeah! Sigma. Sigma. I'm so Sigma. Sigma. Actually, how the, how the thing happened in real life where I was talking to my friend and I did the funny, you know, shush and like I pointed to my jawline and so, a random person just walked by and said, oh, Sigma. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Look, now volunteer, what are you? Man, I remember that one time when a Nazi called me as a Sigma, also this is something. What? what the fuck just happened to the what? server? Uh, <laughs> we're not questioning, we are running. <laughs> what happened? Will SCPs randomly get recontained by the internet connection? Let's see. Uh oh. As the kids would say, what the Sigma? <laughs> Why do I have a private card? Wait, crap, this is... No, it's not useless. And private card is OP. Please don't notice I went here, please. Please, the noise I want here. Thank you. Why not? Actually, not. I don't like the warheads, to be quite honest. Especially here we see, like... When you activate the warhead, you run the risk of the other team 
spawning and you're not being able to do anything against that. What the Sigma? I need to stop saying that because it will become a habit. I, no, seriously, I need to stop. I, it's gonna turn into like my... The, the thing I just say normally, without even thinking. Oh, hello. Desync, do not do this to me right now! Piss off, piss off. One of my rules is that I never shoot the class, but I also never handcuff them, so I just like, whatever, go away. Ah oh, no, it's too much trouble. You try shooting them and suddenly, oh sorry, I have like, just, just, just an FRMG zero. Yeah, whatever. Why is, there, why is there two weapons here? Why would you do this? You're so quirky. Oh, UK. You okay? You're so quirky. Okay, 14 people. This game should still be enjoyable. The Sigma? Uh, half. Alright, so if you charge it, I stand okay. in front, tank the hit, and... Here, half a No, actually oh, not. Charge, charge it, charge it, charge it. Oh, he did the cloud. Come oh, on, come on! Well, right, okay. No point, it's, it's empty. Dog, I can't see the meter when you're doing your fart. Oh, sorry. That's my please disconnect your show phone update. Do not open that. Oh, that's a that's a guy. You can't look away from this game for half a second. So who's the monster now? <laughs> you are mean. And I don't like you. Behind and you, your breath stinks. Yeah, no. And yeah, and I you are ugly. This is exactly what I was going to say. But... Eh, yeah, well, same shit. I keep failing on my experiments, and the dog is facing to death. This yeah. is true. So sad. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm kind of uh, fading to death. He's, no, he's no, it's a, fine. He's getting refrozen. I've just realized that. <laughs> I'm I'm getting dry aged. <laughs> now it's getting put on. How ice much HP do you have left? Uh, my soul just run out. <laughs> nice. He's just getting chilled alive. By the way, I'm gonna take well. great satisfaction in your death. Yeah, no, I know. <laughs> <laughs> the other guy was like, hey, doggy. Nah, that's one of my zombies. Yeah, we activated the generator. 
Oh, he got killed by Tesla Gate. That's kind of funny. Generators aren't too important. We've got no PC. But if they do open, they'll be able to get. Oh, yeah. Yes, you have indeed. You might try opening that door. I'm trying to fucking recreate the fucking Apple's, <laughs> Apple's fucking uh, ringtone. <laughs> Is took a panacea. Stay by the door. Oh. Well, he's gonna assist what? fast, so like it doesn't matter. Oh, there we go. Oh, how did you grab him? No, you've got. Oh, him. there we go. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, wait. Ah, oh, oh, dog, did wait, you die? Dog, did you die? Dog, did you die? Wait, die. No, did you get him out? Come on. Atari break. Just wait, die. <laughs> Why <laughs> don't you die? <laughs> I can't get the surface now. Dumb fuck. How much wait, HP do you have left? How much HP do you have left? Like, over half. Oh my ah. god. Yeah, you're cooked. You're cooked, mister. You ain't winning this today, my boy. I don't like you. <laughs> We've got to get the surface, man. We've got to get the surface and exploit this. You aren't gonna like that either. Slash kill. Oh yeah, we're gonna make a bunch of empty. Oh, that's clear. I'm still on full. I'm just using Dr. Oh, that went to cookie help. sex. Ah, 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 ah. That is the one good feature about dog. Honestly, we win oh, those. No. Oh, did you not get it? Did you <laughs> fart with your mouth? The elevator is yes. a dog. Oh, whoa! <laughs> hey, no, we're gonna put you down. I'm going the to vet called and they said, uh, you need to be put <laughs> down. <laughs> <laughs> okay, actually, like. Main, main protagonist. <laughs> Oop, nope. Well, I'm, I'm also kind of fucking dead right now. And that was the so, main yeah. protagonist right there. The empty have a camping surface. Yeah, no shit. That's where we are. Where on? I'm on surface two by gate A. Oh. Wait, isn't isn't that MTF spawn? No, okay, it's chaos spawn. Oh. Well, we're but by, by MTF. Gate B is MTF spawn. <laughs> There's a mean person shooting me and I don't like that. Oh wow. Oh sorry, ah, oh, sorry, wrong language. Wrong language, I said. Oh, it's not a white. I deny for the resurrection. Thank you. Yo, That's dog close. Frankenstein. That is crazy, I did not know that. What? Cool, yes, that, that is my name. Escape. B boys can escape there. Yeah, I didn't know it either. I accidentally found it out when I was uh, testing on the server by myself. It's, I was it's been a while, dog. Items. It's been a while. Oh. Do you remember me? Yeah. Probably not. No. <laughs> you are yeah. too insignificant for me to remember. Whoa. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> it's been seven months. I just months want you to know that throughout How my life, you? you haven't bring like anything good or like anything in general to my life. You're so unmemorable wow. and so not important to me. Okay, listen, and bro. I no despise you. Don't shit talk me, okay? <laughs> God damn. <laughs> I just wanted to say hi, bro. Hello. <laughs> Don't fret. I will make sure I will forget that we ever met. Have a rules, fam. You're getting moderated. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. No, ban them. Ban them. Now listen, I will not have my authority disrespected yeah, like that. Be, man. He was racist and sexist to me, man. Uh, hold on. Why do I have the car? What? You can't see anything, man. Server rule 5 is if you suspect, suspect people are hacking, report them. If you suspect people are hacking, you can cheat If you suspect people are hacking, you, are hacking, you should hack with them. Are you hacking? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shelly, you hacking, pal? Yeah, you gotta yeah. be honest. Hey, dog. That's a grenade. What? I feel like I heard you. Are we grenading? No, you didn't. Hey! Too bad, a Polish YouTuber or. What? No, that's disgusting. What the frick? Ah, Polish? You're. Hold on, hold on. Let me guess your nationality. Uh, uh, Austrian. Well, that's a new one. Okay. <laughs> German. No. 
What do you sound German, bro? Uh, Let me ask some German. You sound German. <laughs> For all my years, I thought I am Polish, I am Russian, I am uh, in, I am British. Yeah, yeah so somehow <laughs> I am uh, oh, Spanish. I am German. Spanish. Okay. I uh, don't know. Uh, are you, are you, are you, are you, are you, uh, Swedish? <laughs> no. Norwegian? No. Finnish? No. Danish? No. Uh, Don't worry, there's a limited no. amount of nationalities. I think you're gonna figure it out. Belgian? Yeah, no. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Nether, uh, no, not nether. Dodge. No. Starts with P. Uh, Philippines? No. I mean, it's, it does start with P. Wait, are we speaking the language uh, or where you're from? P where I am from. Uh, I am, I'm blanking. Is this a city, country or town? Country. Beginning I'm blanking, bro. Holy shit. P, P, Portugal. No. Not Portugal, huh? not Polish. Why not Polish? I said Polish, you said no. No, I didn't. Oh, you're Polish then. Uh, see, maybe. Polish. I don't know, maybe Polish I'm Russian. Polish. What? You're not maybe Russian. I'm Russian. The Ruski, the Ruski. No. No. Ja Polski, ja Polski. Nie, nie, the Ruski. You are mean. Nie vri, nie vri, the Ruski. Well, yes, I would agree. This is quite mean. It is very. No, what, what's your plan? Hold on. Stand back! Stand back! I'm gonna stand right here and you're not gonna no, 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 make no, no. me do anything else. Bro. <laughs> Bro came out, of, uh, came out of the dust like a fucking superhero. You are mean. No piss off. Bro is yes. the main character. Motherfucker! Can I shoot <laughs> your foot? Uh, if he shoots my foot. Oh, wait, what? That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Are you ready? It's like such a default melody for me. They've played it so much on the piano and just like engraved in my brain by this point. Hey, does someone try recharging this with a Tesla gate? Bruh. Imagine. Zam. Kringo. Kringo. It's like it used to be scarier. By the way, the next thing that's gonna spawn is chaos, so if this is being still enabled, see it's free spectators right now, meaning that a lot of empty have died. It's disabled and it's gonna stay like that. Piss off. Just went here for this. What's here? Oh nice. Probably gonna grab that. Mm, thank you. Nah. Ah! One spectator. Hmm. You're the last one. Well, if my the last one, then we're gonna have to put on a show, won't we? I'm not you, but me. I'm amazing. You suck. All of you watching, you suck. Zombies and twists. Also, zombies suddenly are not SCPs. That's how we're playing.
Also, there's no one spectating you, meaning that there is chaos. Oh, never mind. Maybe someone died. But there is chaos. If I am the last one, it's a result of spectators. Then, there is chaos. Why am I always the last one standing? Why does that always happen? Also, chaos could be kill SCPs. Thank you, thank you. Oh, there's two people dead. So SCPs are fighting with chaos. That's what I'm getting. I need to drop this because it's pointless. What a lovely day, isn't it? Oh, hold. No, I had hopes. I had hopes. They died. Oh. Yeah, I can not actually. There's absolutely nothing I could get from here. It's a grenade. Eh. Whatever. A good grenade can happen on occasion, so you know what? Sure. I don't know why I'm doing this. It's not like a tactic which could abuse. Why is everything playing out in entrance zone? Are the SCPs just stuck there? Why door not doing? I don't need to intervene.
Why would I want to kill them? It's dodging my bullets like in the Matrix. Oh, it's in. I'll get him. No. Yeah. Crap. Finally. Oh, oh you gotta be kidding me! What is this garbage? Another chaos wave! I have survived enough. Sure, they killed an SCP. Oh, whatever! I'm using them from advantage. I should be given tickets. What is garbage? Game is biased. Don't have to keep going with secret map. Please stop speaking. There's a chaos that can't surface, I hope you stop your phone tonight. That's a real freaky game, guys. Lovely. Thank you, I would have died if I was a D-class. Holy crap. Can I... I forgot this server likes to do a bit of tomfoolery. One pute. Stop telling me things like that! Stop telling me SCPs! There is Dikas. What? Incredible. This is crap. But not as crap as you. Oh, I need to find a medkit immediately. Oh, I'm gonna survive another day. Oh, the crackers or something. Easy. That's what we call it in the industry. No. I agree. Up Sigma. Are you, uh, are you going on, uh, going on Skibbity? Sorry, Sigma, but I'm escaping. <laughs> I'm also escaping because I've become a sergeant. It's really cool. That's cheating. No, uh, it's plug in. That's what a true Skibbity gunner from Ohio would do. Thanks. It doesn't blind you. There's no friendly flash or whatever. Is there? I think oh, there God. is. Also, what was the that? Admin abusers. They're coming. And I like abusing people. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Mm, and this. Mm. Mmm, green. Mmm, I like green. Ew. You're Alcohol ew. enough. Alcohol enough. I learned how to 
vibrate my whole wrist just to click quicker. Cool. How much Thanks. hours do you have in cookie clicker? Only like 10. Uh, I didn't AFK it. This is true, you're so sad. Because AFK is for losers. And we are Sigmas. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I feel like I'm <laughs> dropping viewership by saying these things. There was a laser there! There was a laser there! Mine's it was yours. Actually, it might have been just yours. Uh, I'll be all cool and things, but nah. Oh, what a... That's not something that happens on a Friday. Deep wounds? Uh-oh. This is not very Sigma! And by the way, there is a computer that... Oh, there's a lot of them. Yeah, I don't think the computer likes having two of his generators enabled. What the have? Sigma? Crap. No. I'm dying when I know you. Thank you. There is an MTF squad coming here, or at least they're supposed to. Ooh! They'll be coming from that side, so I need to get there. Actually, maybe I can go here. Nah, I'm gonna loot here. He 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 he! I'm gonna steal the cool things and you're not gonna have anything left. <laughs> oh, it's a ghost light. Oh, oh well. Uh, I suppose we can just throw this one out. Shut up! Actually, why am I? Why am I? What am I doing here? Oh, piss off! How many of you are there? Holy crackers! Oh, this is ah. Please do not resurrect me. Thank you. Hee <laughs> hee. Piss off. Remember, when you need to choose your death, die as far away from all 49 as you can. And she's like playing as a zombie, but like, but what is going on with this lad? Oh, it's with everyone. Alright, this is just wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful internet. Oh, yeah, yeah. We call quality. Mm hmm. But I, I recently. Shut up! You're supposed to be silent. Uh, I recently uh, grabbed my. What is. Why are they not moving? Is the server dying again? Well, it looks like it. What, how does the voice chat sound like? Hi! Well, it's normal, incredible. 
Uh, yeah, I, through my old computer, I, I had to like take out uh, a power supply from it uh, for a video. So then I put it back. Uh, and basically, this is like a really old computer with a really old power supply. They were not designed for cable management. They were designed for everything to just, you know, throw it in the box, just cover it up, whatever, throw it under your desk and forget about it. But yeah, I, I've made it tidy and things like that. And one thing about that computer, the power switch is broken. Or like, I have it literally taken out of the computer and it broke. Because I used it with my new computer, because... The power switch on my new computer broke, so then I took the power switch from the old computer and wired it to the new case. But then it also broke, so I have no power switches. I need to use a screwdriver to boot up my computer. But then I look at my uh, old case, and I'm so like, well, you know, the button, the power button is missing, but there's like a reset button. And like, look inside, it's, it's, it's the same wire. So I've managed to like, reconnect that cable that normally would uh, reset the computer, and I managed to wire it up to the power button. Which, by the way, the reset button is so pointless. If you don't know, because you probably might have not encountered it, because it's such a relic from the past. A reset button would be a thing that you would press when your computer would freeze, and it would automatically restart it. Which you can just pretty much do by holding down the power button, which will turn off the computer. Why are we here? Hey, I have a question for you. Yes. Your microphone is very good quality. What is it? A blue snowball. What do you mean? A blue, blue snowball? Yeah. Ah, uh, gotcha. Sick. Thank you. That's what I want yeah, to Yeah, thank you. Microphone. Thank you for this interview. You're welcome. Yeah. What do you want to be? I will let you be any chaos you want. Whatever. Roller, rifleman, repressor. Rare. Mmm, admin abuse. Mmm, I like, I like abusing people. Hey guys, I want to shoot things! What are you doing? Why you shoot me? Why you mean? Hey Dr. Doolittle, get out of there. Sorry, do so you make monsters? What? No. But your Dr. Frankenstein. D-O-C-K! <laughs> you have the thing in front of your eyes. You can see that there is a K there. Was the doc named after Frankenstein? Yes. Which Frankenstein? We're talking about here. It's up to the interpretation of the reader. What's up to whose interpretation? So he's Doc Frankenstein. Oh, he's Frankenstein. So the Doc is named after Frankenstein. But that entails oh. Dr. Frankenstein's Doc, which means it's the Doc of Dr. Frankenstein. That's, so Doc, cool, Dr. Frankenstein. Yes, imagine if Frankenstein yeah, just, yeah. owned a boat. So where would he dock it? Exactly. That's where Dr. I come in. Yeah. That's where I come in. Uh, why did he just get... Uh, he just vanished. That's where I come in. What? <laughs> that guy just vanished before my eyes. I think he got admin, sir. Well, there goes gravity. Oh, this is a bad idea. Eh, what's living without a bit of living? Oh, I'm disappointed. I'm just pointed in the wrong direction. This is truly so sad. Please now go and give a valuable speech. I will rate it on a scale from 1 to 2. I rate it a 1. It's like 50%. Is it, is it weird that when people say, I rated uh, from a scale from 1 to 10, and then they go 0 out of 10? Hi, mice. Make something funny happen, please. This is very boring. Hello, Sale. How's it going? 
I may have just told mice to make something funny happen to expect randomness. That's not good. Mmm. Mmm. Crap. Oh, hello. Oh, you are fast! Oh, you, I am stuck in here with you, aren't I? What the Sigma? I used the adrenaline, why did I have the effects twice? Well, he hit me three times. Maybe that's what happened. It's gonna revive me now. Relax. Oh, piss off! But there's a Tesla trap right here, kill yourself! End no. it! No! Oh, thank the lord. I'm just gonna sit here and complain. I'm gonna have to hear all of it. I'm not pissed off, I'm not gonna get AHP from you. What? Are you the real Doc Frankenstein? Yes, I am the doc that f Dr. Frankenstein used to dock his boat. I just see you immediately go on. Uh, you're kidding. Right, I'm I'm gonna commit to this up. Well, no, that's my job. No. -uh. I I I've turned emo now. You're literally breaking roleplay. All four nine supposed to all four nine dash twos are supposed to commit suicide. Bruh. Oh no, sorry, no. Uh, uh what's the modern art for Skibbity, that's so skibbity of you. Ah. I really like man. <laughs> I understood that completely. Are you kidding? Right, we're fighting this wave. I'm getting sick of this crap. Get ready, Dr. What's the Sigma? <laughs> I'm terribly sorry for the words I speak on this stream. Relax, I'll handle it. I am the angry pumpkin. Uh, that's great to hear. Thank you. No, let me go. Let me go. I just want pills. I just want pills. Hello. Oh, I Oh, it's the official Donald Trump. Are we working with the chaos? We have uh -huh. official Donald Trump on hey, our team. Please, I'm just trying to get pills. Thank you. Thank you so much. Trying to get Donald pills. Mr. President! Well, he's not yet. I'm still talking about the hit game Fair Mr. Back President. Back Released on 2016. I need you back in light uh, and heavy ASAP. I need my pills. My gens are on. My gens are on. I'm gonna die, bro. Get in. Nah, you're that's going. fine. How would you do it yourself then, and just wait for us to do everything for you? Hey, um, I went AFK for a minute. The fact that that guy. Forget about it. Forget about it, doctor. Turn the gens off, please. Yeah, I'm gonna it's die. It's a little bit freaky. Why would you? Why would you kill me, doctor? It's a bit freaky. Why? Doctor, forget I'm everything. Me pill, I'm protecting the pill pile. I just want to protect the pill pile. I had Why seven pills. Follow the pings. Follow the pings. Follow the pings. Follow the pings. I know. Yeah, full health. Follow the Follow the pings. Go and go into heavy. ASAP. You're you're gonna die before I do this, father. No, 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 no. Doctor, what the fuck are you doing there? Leave, leave gate B now. Nah. -uh. Leave gate B, I'm gonna die. I fucking opened it for you. It's oh, for the love of God, bro, we're so dead. <laughs> I'm not dying. I'm Where? Not dying.
Where? They're in, the they're in service. They're in service. They're in service. Where? I'm about to die. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, why am I not they're, dying? They're Come they're on, they're they're chaos. The zombie who's by service. They're at the top. They're at the top. Oh, how did you run out of ammo on a lot of stuff? I was just up running with chaos. Oh, you turn suck. Up, turn up. Turn up. Turn up. They're at the top. They're at the top. You're by them, zombie. Well, that's what we call a GG. That's when we press the G key. G for gaming. Ah. Uh. Let's see. The last chaos standing. But he got the cool gun. Ma. It wasn't even a bra, it was just a ma. <laughs> no. Oh, by the way, before the stream, I went in to brush my teeth so that she wouldn't smell my disgusting gob. Because that's how it works. And recently, the, f the fun thing about teeth, I learned about an entire, like, uh, like scum industry, let's say, of toothbrushes. And it's not like a scam industry, but basically, I've just been played in a game of 4D chess. So, context. A lot of people have different types of teeth. Some can never brush uh, theirs and survive their entire life with no problems. And some could like even use this word dental floss. Like, who uses dental floss? And they can like have so many different holes that they need to keep patching up. I'm one of these lads. Okay, I'm maybe not that bad, but yeah, my teeth aren't really that rigid. So, uh, two years ago, exactly, my toothbrush broke. I had an electric toothbrush, it broke. Well, whatever, uh, quite sad. I had it for quite a lot of years, throughout my, well, most of my life. And I went to the dentist, and once again, there was like, you know, oh, just, you know, we need to patch up 12 different holes because you suck. And uh, yeah, I was there with my father, and my father said, okay, you know what? I'm gonna buy an electric toothbrush right now. So where do we go? Well, internet is not a place, but a place is Media Expert, which is an electronics shop in Poland that sucks. Never buy anything from them. Like, okay, generally, they sometimes have good prices, and it's quite easy to get things... Uh, on warranty, as I experienced with this toothbrush. But they suck. Oh, let me tell you, they suck. They like scamming people. You don't even know how much. So we went there. And, uh, yeah, I had a lot of experiences with talking to reps when they recommend you absolute garbage. Like one of my friends, when he was trying to buy a laptop in 2016, he got recommended some like crappy Dell laptop with 4 gigabytes of RAM. And he's, and uh, yeah, the guy said, oh yeah, it can run any modern game like Witcher and things like that. You could not open a web browser with that thing. So yeah, I have a very terrible experience of media experts and just generally talking to reps like that because they want to like, get rid of garbage. And, uh, oh, yeah, snails here. Oh God. we said, we want the toothbrush, so we went to the toothbrush section and he said, okay, this, the, uh, this toothbrush, uh, yeah, it's probably, it's one of the, like, uh, better models we, we have, it's a sonic toothbrush, and oh, it's sonic, like, electric, electric toothbrushes, these are cringe, sonic toothbrushes, that's where the game is at, that's where we game, you know, 100, he said 100, you know, So we got the toothbrush. It, it costed quite a lot. I think it was like 500 zloty, which is about $100. I'm not sure where you live and how the prices are for you, but for a toothbrush, that's quite a lot of money. At least for me. At least in Poland. Uh, yeah, I think I need to reload this. And you know what? It was great. Great experience. It, it had... To, you could charge it, I had a traveling case, you could change the tips, and would like notify when to change the tips when they were broken. That was quite nice. 
But then, after six months, I go on before school. I go on to brush my teeth. Huh. That's weird. The toothbrush is really loud. And when I tried, like, brushing my teeth, I realized that the end wasn't really moving. Or, like, it was moving, but... It wasn't, like, really moving. The, the thing that was moving was the part in between. That would normally stay still, but was now just waving all over the place. So it broke. That's fine. Electronic things break, but whatever. I went into Media Expert. It was quite a smooth experience. I filled out the form. They repaired it in a week. That was great. Well, off we go, continuing using this toothbrush for another six months, because guess what happens after those six months again? It broke again. And at that point, I was just like... Well, that's concerning, especially that it was exactly six months, both times. So this time, when I went to get it R&D'd... No crap, that's not what you call it. When I went in to uh, get it fixed, I asked, like, how does it work? Oh crap! Uh, like when I get when I get it fixed, does the warranty extend? And they said, no. Oh no, sorry, no. It does extend. The warranty gets extended when you return the broken product and they fix it. And they say, yeah, this thing was broken and you should get an extended warranty by a week. By a week that it was in repair. A standard warranty in Poland, and I think in Europe, is two years. After that, no warranty. So I asked, can I get it fixed after the warranty expires? And they said, well, it would be too expensive, so I think you would be just better off buying a new toothbrush. Excuse me, what? Another six months passes, the toothbrush broke again, I return it, I get it fixed, I get it back. And after six months, it broke again. Another day, another victory for the OG. Actually, it started breaking. It started breaking. And currently it's like sort of loose, but I can still use it. And, uh, yeah, I don't have warranty. So I tried, like, looking, how do you fix this? Uh, not really possible. I mean, like, you would need to replace most of the body for it to be waterproof, with, which, for something that goes into your mouth, I think you want it to be waterproof. You know, just a suggestion. So currently, I'm just trying to finish off the spare tips that I have. And to get a replacement as soon as I can, to get a new toothbrush that isn't this. And I went in, and I did some research about this toothbrush. Turns out, it's like a refreshed uh, version of an older model. Which... Uh, Stop talking, I need to focus. I need to focus on speaking. It's a uh, refreshed uh, version of an older model, which was notorious for breaking. To the point where Philips took it from their site. When I got the toothbrush, I was so confused, like, why can't I, like, look... Why can't I find it on their site? Because I was looking for something. I don't even remember what, but I needed to find something on their website. And I just couldn't find it. Guess why? Because it sucks. It sucked so much that even Philips just refuses to admit that it existed. So, when the rep told me this is one of the tooth best, toothbrush best toothbrushes they had, what in reality what he meant was that... Hey man. I'm talking. What, what he meant was like, what? we want to get rid of this. Ah, by the way, this is like not the first time something like this happens to me. I, uh, like I had a lot of uh, occurrences where I 
I have like an entire st uh, history with headphones. I would buy headphones from media expert and they would suck. I was little by then, so I didn't actually like, you know, do anything uh, about that. Uh, there was also another crap, I can't remember, there was like a really bad example of how I got scammed by the rep again. I can't recall it. Yeah, but generally, like so many times, these people are just whipping you off. They're trying to get rid of things that are taking up inventory. But that sucks so much, no one is buying them, so they need to convince you that it's good so that they can just get rid of it. And what sucks about it is that, you, you know, you could say, oh, you should be more careful, you shouldn't, like, talk to the you should do your own research. With the toothbrush thing, I was kind of like, okay, he will probably try scamming us, but I thought, no, wait, that's like an actual good-looking toothbrush, it looks like a decent product, Phillips looks good. I didn't have time to research because, you know, when my father gets set on something, I can't really, like, stop him. But, you know, with headphones, what was I supposed to do? I was little, didn't know anything. And my mother was just trying to buy me some headphones that I could listen music to. Actually, not, not listen to music, but I was, I was even using headphones for whatever, you know what I'm saying. What was I supposed to do? What was she supposed to do? She's not into that knowledge about all that stuff. And there's no repercussion for these people to just completely, like, rip you off and do this thing where they sell you a faulty product and then when it breaks, they, don't, they are not responsible for that. And I refuse to believe that they didn't know that it was faulty, okay? Hey. Hey. I'm dangerous. I'm guessing that. I'm also guessing that you are blind and do not notice me sitting in this spot. Ah! We. Oui. Oh, you did notice me. Well, that sucks. Already gone. Oh. I, can't kill I feel like you're lying to me, but whatever. Oh no, I am. It's just I'm not going to. Cool. Thanks. And then we went our separate paths, never to meet again. In this round. That is not something... Would you not kill me? No, no, no. Well, thank you. There's no K, there's no KOS server. Oh, nice. This is an no KOS server. I just watched your video, by the way. <laughs> it's funny, I just realized that too. Zam. Let's go. I wouldn't go that way, though, because the SCP is one. Yeah, that sounds point. like a bad idea. Uh, so how was your day block? Good. Oh, come this way. I found two spare SATA cables in my old computer case. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Can never have too little of those. What? Do you, do you know about the gamble plug that we have? I cannot hear you. Okay. I was saying, did you hear about the 1162 plug that we have? No. Take this, go drop it inside uh, 173 is old spawn room. So the idea is, if you drop one item, you can uh, uh, get other things in return for it, but the more you drop, the more likely you are to die. Mobile task force Using a gun, thanks. micro, I got this bad boy. But just be careful, you will die, potentially. Huh. Why would you close this thing? You're an actual menace. I tried to put things in there sometimes so the light turns on it. Why did you do this? So 
So. So. Now uh, you should take this in case they start chasing us. There you go. Nah. I don't believe in SCPs. Uh oh, bro. Why would you look at that? I just changed my belief system. Yeah. Uh, he's right behind us. This time. Nice. Uh, that was good. Uh, would you look at that? Yeah, I don't think you would have a third charge. I. Just barely enough for one. Okay, great, let's go. Yippee! Oh, nice! Yippee! Let's spice this up. Let's spice this up. You're, you're gonna take my gun, you're gonna cuff me, we're both gonna become chaos. Uh, fine. You know, you can escape through that way too. That's messed up. Yeah, it's probably a plug. One out of three. No, no, Why no, are you no, pointing no. at me? You mean. You mean. You are mean. You are mean. You are mean. Hey, Donald. Donald. Donald, I know you have PTSD from the last time, but. Bruh. What are you doing? No. We are doing oh, this. Run. Take it. Let's do it. I can't wait to kill him. Come on, come on. <laughs> let's, let's no go. president is gonna stop us. Out of three generators activated. I absolutely do not have the scope to do this. It's like way into exit, so we should have enough time to just get there. Maybe he's waiting for us there. Three out of three generators activated. All generators. Here's a hut. He probably has a hut. What a lad. Reveal yourself. Donald Trump, put your hands up with me. Why am I using this thing? Take your candy back. Mm. Oi, oi, oi. Say Se one guy, one guy. <laughs> Seriously. One guy. Oh yeah, by the way, I did not mention this, but I managed to get into college. Yay. <laughs> well, that's like the really old news by this point, but whatever.
just, just so that it's on record. I am smart. Actually, like, the fact that she's getting into college doesn't really mean that you're smart, it just... Actually, it doesn't mean anything. It's Do we have any other SCPs? No, you're just a single one. God damn it. Like, there are private colleges which, you know, we just pay money to get into. Like, you know, these... Mr. Dr. It's easier. Name. That's what I'm saying. When you have money, it's easier. Larry, generally, in life. Yeah, but no, I went to public college. I mean, I went, I will go. Why did I press that button? Exactly, me when I'm scared. Ooh hoo hoo! Ooh hoo hoo! Ooh hoo hoo! Catch him, Gary! First one bites the dog. Why are there. They're used. What? No, oh, someone late joined. Ah, ah, ah! I hear doors. There were 10 people at the beginning of the round. Hello. Hey guys. Uh, bad news, uh, scientists already have all five, so. Nah. Ah, ah, oh no, they're a, gonna activate the femur breaker. Room. Oh wait. No, we can't. There's no femur. Shut up. Alright, got it. You know my boss, man. I can do whatever I want. Come on. I am a level 100 mafia boss, and you're just a goon. What a lad! I'll get him, wait, look. What a lad! You should all um, jump off now, if he did that. Oh, I guess I still don't want to kill him. I take everything I said, man. You have to take everything I said. Oh. <laughs> How many colors did he have on him? <laughs> How many did you drink? One. A scientist killed himself. One? I drank one! That's ridiculous! But what's it should not have cola. Yeah. What is this garbage? How how, how did Absolutely scoldly dabbling all over the floor. Oh! Yeah, me oh, went shit. the 18th letter of the character. Uh, uh, alphabet words. <laughs> oh, he has pills. What a lad. Ah, oh, he almost fell for them up. Well, that would have been sad. I'm chasing sail And you've right perfectly now. landed for me to revive you. <laughs> I know as well. Uh, they're mostly in heavy. One, I think, is in light. One's in 106's room, hiding in the, uh, on top of the metal thing. Let's go. I was playing on a Polish server where, like, some people know that I make English videos, but, like, not many people, and one of them joked, like, please, oh, can I be in your next YouTube account. video? And I think it would be really funny if I just included him as, like, a background footage. Oh, sh I'm gonna do that. I need to find a place. Why did I call this elevator? I'm dumb. Gather children, as I tell you a story. A story of old. Passed on through many generations. Oh, This corpse has expired. I don't think he went this way. Did you guys drop the checkpoint? Oh, yeah. uh, uh, I went for uh, I went for checkpoint in entry, oh. in entrance zone. Right, I'm gonna flank towards a south checkpoint where you guys are heading. Excuse me, what? Light calling? What is this garbage? 
Well. I just found the other was drunk. You, uh, you ghost, can you do a funny admin panel and check where Mary is? What a funny. Oh, Mary? Oh, no. yeah, 100%, because they are uh, I, yeah. I thought there was, there was an actual guy. Also, and revive the guy, bruh. Oh, it's just garbage! How dare you spawn mid re revive? Where'd you fucking go? <laughs> 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 Where the fuck is he? I'm gonna sniff them out, you're gonna lead them to him. And I'm still full health. Oh, what is the masturbation? I don't believe in proximity chat. I think it's cheating. Ah, fuck. Oh, what? I'm not taking my chances. How does prox chat work? What do you press? Normally it's alt, but that's not working for me. It's not like surprised people can manage to like bind a key on your key by and, uh, keyboard to like do proximity chat and things. Fucking got a new kitten and the allergies are making me sneeze. So I unplugged my mic and reset oh. my setting, that's why I was loud. Okay. What? I was talking to uh, 106, he said he got it. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I got a kitten and I think I'm allergic to cats even though I've got an adult cat. It's making me sneeze. Yeah, so my this is really so sad. Uh, no, it makes my eyes really red. What's it's the, like, uh, bitch red. What's the breed? Uh, uh half main coon. CME is. CME is mine. I'm gonna revive him for a door. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, she's the kitten I put in the group, in the pet shop. Come on, lad, you play the video game now. Chop chop. My kill killed five rats. I'm gonna get steal mice the next one, but. Oh. What that happened? A no, that was an exploding zombie. There's smoke coming from his body. What is go what? Let me see where. He exploded. <laughs> it's not even a grenade, it just exploded. <laughs> One out of three generators activated. Wait, he got an 05, why didn't. Oh, he left the game, what the lad? Why didn't he just open this thing? He's just a dumbass. Are you stupid? And he left the game, what the lad? That? Wait, he has oh two my god. Fives. Wait, yo, come back. If you ever he has do two this, fives. you suck. But if I do this, that's perfectly fine. How can I not find a single person out of seven? Maybe because we're in the facility and it's. Everyone is using huts and. Everyone just got like eight huts and they keep reusing oh. them. I had gate. Checkpoint gate. Oh, are they on surface? Oh, 106, come here. They're on surface? Oh, they are at gate Probably. B, at least two of them. Okay, I'm coming. Open the gate. That's an elevator. This is an exciting SCP-049 gameplay. Yeah. I'm at gate A. Okay, go for gate oh, A then. Oh, shh, shh, shh. Damn it. I hear doors opening. Yeah, that's us. Okay. I hear them. Should I talk to him? Hey, Doc. Nah. Should I talk to him? Nah. We don't. We don't exist, by the way. Nah. Right. They will surely not expect us to be here. <laughs> they are all going towards Gate B right now. Good. 
That's where we are. I'm gonna push him towards you. Cool. Wait, am I AFK? What? So you've been AFK for 66 seconds. Mm -hmm. You'll automatically be kicked. <laughs> oh, you're AFK, oh, yeah. You're making the experience oh, for chaos. everyone worse. Uh. I'm AFK too, nice. Just move one step. Like this. 72 seconds. Man. Are you pushing down? Uh, shooting the I fuck out of me, I'm on 200 HP. You suck at pushing. Maybe you can sink, you can sink down in the floor. We generate your shield then. I hear what them. is We're this? Them. Garbage, can we play the video game? God damn. What are we supposed to do now? <laughs> oh, it's chaos. It's chaos, so you're about oh, to kill him, no, We can camp here. Because he'll definitely go up if chaos I am kill too him. bored. I'll kill him, I. I'll get in the elevator. Yep, he's definitely here. I swear song! Thanks. Oh! Bro, what kind of jump scare was that? Uh, bye bye. I, I can kill that karma. Shooting. Yeah, you're gonna die. Sigma! Don't oh, die. Oh Why did he do that? Yeah. Oh, come on, you're gonna die. And... I'm gonna die too. That's fine. I'll shield it. That's how you do it. <laughs> now I'm gonna camp and regenerate my health. <laughs> Why go, nah. Look at my, look at the health bar. What do we mean go? We stay, we stay. Amen. fight like a sigma a sigma must know when to retreat Wait for the ability to recharge. Uh. So, see the escape. So I can barely see. I don't think he's there. Oh, there he is. Oh no, what the Sigma? Back off, buddy. I'm gonna have to get Sigma on you. 
It's true. North foot we work surface zone. So garbage. Bye, Sigma. You're not You are skibidi. The SCPS of the gameplay. Yo, SCPS is fire at the gameplay. I know that you just have terrible internet. What do you mean seven? Where did that number come from? Why was there a we strong wave? Why do I keep you. rubber okay, banding? Okay. Ah! Hey, no but you press down the alt keyboard, you can speak to me. Oh, oh no! My revive bar is rubber banding! What is this garbage? My revive. Let me out! Let me out! Let me out! Ah! I'm literally stuck in intercom because it keeps rubber banding me there. Intercom opened. Oh. I keep. I'm laggy as hell. Yeah. Can I show you? Oh, there's a guy there. Don't care. No, stay here. Why did you call this? I'm with you. To the end. Whether you like it or not. By the way, zero bad. question. I did not mean to oh. shoot you. Okay, okay, hey, hold on. Hey. He touched me! He touched me! And I die, thank you. There's a shotgun. Just fucking. Just fucking. Ah! I just supposed to do in that yes! situation, by the way. No, 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 I think we can do a fun thing. I would really like to rewatch some of like my older video. Oh, this is just wrong. This this is just this is just wrong. I used to just come up when I typed in Doc Frankenstein, I fell off, I fell off. I would like to watch like so, so, some old video of mine. Crap, I know, oh yeah, this one. This one is what, that got the, pop, the most popular. I would like to review how horrible my takes were. <laughs> before Let's I, see. Before I started playing... Hold up, before I start playing this video, I need to silence you. Before I started playing, what? 
What? Why is this happening? I don't before, know before, I, before I started playing, I guess this I is, didn't play any games. Oh, that's the problem. Okay, now that makes sense. Before I started playing SL, I didn't play any games at all, which is quite ironic for a video game developer. But one day I saw some person on YouTube tryharding this strange game called STP Secret Laboratory. It had so much depth, so many mechanics, and so much polished spirit. And I. Okay, crap. I need to. I feel like a lot of people did not get this joke, but there are a lot of Polish games made that, like, you know, are generally like. reference. Uh... The war or just occupation, and so many of them, like, just featured these, which I know, like, they were a part of our culture. Actually, I should change the name of the stream. There we go. Yeah, that, that's that's the joke, in case you didn't know. I know a couple of Polish games, like so many, so, so many times, like they just reference war, occupation, God, of course, Christianity, we, ha we have to have this, and these things, they are everywhere. Disgusting. And I can play it for free, without microtransactions? It's really sad that this command was removed from the game, and now there is actually more skins, or maybe... Still exist, I don't know. Never mind. But quickly I realized that not many people shared my specific interest in the game, and instead, whenever they would see someone tryharding, they would start harassing him, telling him death threats, and even hacking his Xbox gold account. Despicable. Was that an attempt, attempt at a joke? Man, I sucked. <laughs> oh man. Oh man, oh man. All of them. Servers would also have a dedicated section in the rules that said Please don't use experts and go in places that artists cannot access easily because I'm stupid and I don't know how to play this game. Blah 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 blah. Uh, okay, like. It's really like. I, I really don't think this is a good way of critiquing something when you just. You know, make fun of the other side. It's fun to make fun of the other side, but I'm just like, oh, look at me, I'm so stupid. Be, 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 be. Don't call people stupid. Call... Most of the time, people aren't stupid. They are either just blind, so sometimes by choice, or just like, I don't know, they have a different opinion. And yet, that was a thing, you know, the cell. Uh, like, people used to play this game casually, and there were so many, like, complaints. Or, like, oh, the sweaty players, they ruin everything. But they. I don't know, I really like watching them, because it wasn't... As compared to, like, uh, CSGO, or, uh, that's a terrible comparison, to other games, it wasn't that, oh, he can shoot the gun, no. It was like, wow, he was able to react to that quite quickly. It was a reaction, and it was approach to different scenarios. That was impressive to me. I absolutely don't care that someone can shoot a gun well. And when I get killed by someone who can shoot a gun well, I am... I don't know. Annoyed. But this, like, yeah, I honestly, people piss off. That was fun to watch. I'm not joking. This is literally what it said word for That's a joke. Man, the comedy is so dead. Reward. Currently, the gaming industry is composed of these kinds of people. These days, you can see many new games implement aim assist for gamepad players, even though it's a PC game. Or gun accuracy, which makes some of your bullets miss just to make sure that everyone is at an equal playing field. This aged quite poorly. <laughs> and the current trend of uh, FPS games is that they focus so much about uh, on uh, like the hardcore players, you know, so that they can have their own uh, leagues and uh, competitions and things like that. And it, it happened with Halo. This would be like a casual game, and now it's so, uh, it's so sweaty. So like. Like, what are you talking about? I kind of understand it, so that... Okay, no, actually, no, I don't understand it. I know where I was coming from here. For many years, it was so difficult to get, like... Say anything about the cell. It's so, so difficult to form any opinion. And I was thinking that as it was becoming more casual... Well, actually, it was completely different. SL was becoming a sweat fest. 
But I was blind. Actually, what was it? during what update was this? Mm. Oh yeah, garbage take and subscribe. Oh yeah, I, I think I watched like a part of this video a while ago and I just commented this. Like, if you agree with this video, you are actually stupid. I'm playing since Megaverse 2 and I agree with what you are saying. No, you are dumb. What did I say here? I can't kill 27 people. Wait, one year ago I pointed out that you, I were saying you're stupid. What? Did, did I just make this video fully knowing that my take was bad? <laughs> what is going on? Also, I like this background. But the, the YouTube way didn't like it. it compressed it so heavily. Actually, I didn't like this background. Never mind. Yeah, but my point was that, oh, people are becoming too casual. No, shut up. It was a completely different thing that was happening. What was happening was that the game was gaining depth. Something I wanted, by the way, from this video. I would like to imagine I am the main reason why SL sucks these days, because of this video. But yeah, SL was becoming more... Just... I don't know, there was more depth to the guns, there was more depth to the SCPs and things like that. Actually, like, crap, was there more depth to SCPs? Were there, there were more mechanics. That's what it was. So you had to know a lot more and you had to know how to use it a lot more. Man. And this brings us back to Secret Laboratory. You see, a long time ago, SL had more mechanics than it currently has. I mean, yes, we have the new useful SCPs and the useless SCPs, but have you heard about 106 window jump, cancelling fall damage, grenading elevators, teleporting grenades with elevators, hanging in this room, destroying the HID at the start of the round, joking 096 near gates, sacrificing yourself to get SCP-173 killed by Antigit, and so, so many more. And guess what? They gone! All of them! You might say, oh, but these are exploits. Okay, and? I understand, these are... <sighs> Once again, it's fun to look at this in hindsight with what I shall become, because this was... Uh, this was Parabellum. Crap, this was Parabellum? No, you wait. Say, oh, no, it wasn't Parabellum. No, screw it. No, maybe it was. Developers intended you to use... No, it wasn't Parabellum. Wait, crap, it wasn't Parabellum. Oh, no, this aged so poorly. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, so SL pretty much at that point was weird. Wait, this wasn't Parabellum? No, I don't believe this. No, this was Parabellum. No, this was Parabellum. Oh yeah, crap, no, I remember, this was Parabellum. I made this video because I was so pissed for Northwood not doing anything and the game kind of being annoying. And I didn't really know why. So I made this garbage video. Man. Nah. Crap, what was he talking about? Oh yeah, these were exploits. Yeah. With all the cell. That was weird. Scoop of was weird. They removed exploits. Because in all this, you might think once again that, oh, these are exploits. These, these are bugs. It didn't really matter back then. It was actually weird that they removed it because SL was so known for having bugs and having to utilize them. It was, and it was fun. Like, SL felt like an immersive sim, except that it wasn't an immersive sim, because it was like a game, but it didn't really tell you what to... I mean, like, you know, someone coded this, but they didn't really think things through. So then you had to approach situations by yourself. And sometimes, yes, the result of that would be, do this, because this is the best way of doing this. But still felt, felt free. So when we have exploits that you can cancel uh, jumping from a ledge, that was really good. That was really good. Like, you could run away from a dog and you, you could just, like, pretend that you are jumping off because people used to do that, by the way, back then. Now it's now you would be like, why did he kill himself? But yeah, people used to just kill themselves for fun. And, uh... Yeah. You could, like, you know, cancel fall damage and you'd survive. And that was so great. I remember doing that and it was so great. And I hated servers that prevented me from doing that. I think these are exploits. That's what I was talking about earlier. Because I felt like it was a part of a cell. But a lot of people didn't really appreciate. Which, you know what? I still think that. I still think exploits, they were quite fun. I mean, they were probably the thing that inspired me to play a cell. Because I watched Hubert play a cell like that, using the exploits, which is just funny. The, may, uh, the, the CEO, actually, was not for the thing back then. Yeah, the CEO of the company that makes a game, 
uses exploits, and just refuses to patch them. They're so fun. But guess what? They kept them anyway. But sadly, things quickly started changing. Over the years, Northwood started patching those little exploits, starting with Scoopophobia and ending with Parabellum. This was quite sad. See, I mentioned Parabellum, this was during Parabellum. You could no longer use and master these hidden mechanics. So this is how a typical match would look like. Time to do a mild amount of tamfoolery. Sad part is that this is such an infamous clip for me. I did not record my microphone, I was so mad, but whatever. Okay, if you don't know, by the way, this is all the cell. I need to explain this because some of you might not know this. Uh, back then, bombing elevators, 100% uh, kill rate. Actually, not always. You could sometimes, like, uh, when a grenade fell in a certain spot, you could hide on a specific uh, spot in the elevator to survive it. That's why I threw another flashbang and that's why I started shooting, just in case. But it didn't matter. Turns out, we don't need the bugs. The game itself had so many different mechanics that it could hold up on its own without them. But we didn't celebrate for long. More precisely, we celebrated for exactly 382 days. Parabalelu Fabalunarelu. Parabellum was such an amazing update. It introduced the new 17. Was it? Was it? Was it really? What? Mr. Cock Frankenstein, would you think Parabellum was a. That's an absolute horrible preview. Do you think Parabellum was a good update? Do you think Parabellum was a good update? Please tell me. Ah. A lot of people really like Parabellum, they still do. I have, I have opinions now, okay? I don't go by what the public says. I have such a different take on a cell. That I never see anyone talk about the things I feel, and I really want to make a video about it. But not now, I'm working on a translation video, and after that I'm working on something that won't be about the cell, and then I'm gonna tackle just my... the many issues of... Modern, current SCP scared laboratory, not this garbage. I didn't know what I was talking about back then. Even free, which the community had very mixed opinions on. And a graphics uplift, which made the game unbearably dark, but it had better performance. Oh, Holy garbage, this pathetic joke of a frame rate. What is this pathetic piece of garbage? Uh crap. Okay, so never mind. I I guess I hated problem too. <laughs> Actually, no, I I think I liked the guns. That's changed. Uh, yeah, performance took a tank. By the way, it's so funny to look at it. And problem is now notorious for just completely destroying the performance. Like being the the second update, uh, on like one of the worst running uh, updates to the game. The the first one, of course, being uh, refracted reality 13.0. But when it when the beta came out, it was people were saying, "Wow, the performance has gotten so much better. You can even get up to seventeen more frames per second." That did not age well. That did not age well. <laughs> and uh, what did I talk about again? Oh yeah, uh, dark uh, facility. Now the facility is quite bright, and that's a bad thing. And a lot like. Even like, uh, when I was rewatching this video a while ago, I felt like, oh, yeah, I guess Dark Facility was good. But no, Parabellum was extremely dark. As you can see in this Other performance. clip, it got really compressed. Because, f like, these pixels are really similar, so YouTube compresses them. It was a real issue back then, that so many YouTube videos would get absolutely destroyed by YouTube. Because the game was so dark. On top of it, Surface Zone, especially Surface Zone, if you saw a tutorial, a class that's red, you could mistake them for a Chaos Insurgent. It was that bad. You, I had to turn up my monitor brightness so high up. My eyes hurt after that. So no, when people say Parabellum looked great, no it didn't. The game had to, uh, needed to receive like a slight uh, uh, change in graphics so it would be a bit more brighter. Not as much as it is in 13.0. But this was atrocious, especially as a YouTuber. Oh, no. 
Okay, we've already watched this. Front end play anymore, this is a slideshow. Okay, I give up. Parabellum changed a lot of things on the front end and back end, but it also pushed the game into this new direction that Northwood is taking. Because what Northwood oh, currently runs is control. When the game oh, came out, Hubert allowed server owners to change every single small detail in the configuration. Later, people started making plugins which could modify the balance even more. But by giving this flexibility, he couldn't make sure that the game was fair on every server. But he didn't really care. For such a complex game, there isn't an objective way to balance things. Many people can feel differently about different aspects of the game, which was noticeable back then with people hating 106, while others hating on <laughs> There was no point in saying anything was unbalanced because your opinion could change in a matter of weeks. So I still agree with this. I'm not sure about the last part, because I still feel like I just said that, but it was a bit of a fuzzy memory. But man, yes, a cell cannot be balanced. You can try. And Esse and Norfolk, yes, they did try taking more control. And to this day, like it's not an, there, there aren't many things that you can change in the config files in, in terms of gameplay. You can change how often people spawn, but you can't like adjust I don't know how much time it takes for 096 to trigger or how, how long his trigger cycle is, whatever. And used to change a lot of things. Because... Uh, especially playing on different regions. A lot of people approach the game differently. For example, on one server, people shoot D-class. On the other, they don't. They cuff them. So, suddenly, we have a situation where on the server where people shoot D-class, it's a lot easier for SCPs to kill other people. Because, well, they are already killing themselves. But if they don't shoot D-class, then SCPs need to do more work. So how do you balance that? The answer is that you can't. It's not just that this single rule, like some people, for example, are better with shooting guns, while others are better at, for example, uh, I don't know, uh, managing in, uh, quickly thinking in intense situations. And all of these things, with as complex as the game is, you cannot predict every single way that people will approach your game. You cannot balance your game around every single person. So yes, I still do agree with this. So how can Norfolk achieve this level of control? Well, they kind of just took away the complexity of many mechanics. Here are some examples. You can no longer grenade elevators since they decrease the damage. Also, the grenade kind of sucks now. You can no longer do a mild amount of tomfoolery and shoot 939 with a silencer while crouching. You can no longer create useful and powerful items from nothing in 914. And yes, you can create the micro from a com 15, but it's really inconsistent compared to flashbacks and very fine. Throwing to ghost lights no longer can open doors without a keycard. That's been changed. You can do that again, I think. I think. I know, this works. SCP-018 used to be very consistent, which was great for opening doors that you didn't have access to. But it's... Man, well, I remember this. There was like a spot on the wall which you had to throw the ball at. More random, and now it bounces for so long there isn't really a point in targeting a single door. SCP-330 has been turned from a boof of wacky superpowers into a... Medicament dispenser that can cut off your hands. Like when the fanbase told you to keep it, they definitely didn't want this. Okay, I could. F it's a bit weird. What I'm saying here is that they Norfolk wanted more control, so they did this. But I think they didn't really want control. Actually, no, I think it was a part of it why they removed some of these like weird things that not many people knew about. But I think the other part was that they were trying to make the game more mainstream. Or more like more understandable to the uh, typical user. Yeah, I think it was ab about control. They wanted to create this like fine-tuned experience instead of just like throwing things at the wall, which was respectable. Not really what I wanted to see. Yeah, that's what I'm whining about here. <laughs> I'll find even more examples of this, but I think I've made myself clear. Currently, the game is really mainstream and casual friendly, which I think is supposed to bring. This did not age well. <laughs> Casual friendly. Man, my brother in Cristo. <sighs> the guns. Yeah, by the way, I didn't really notice this for a very long time. Because, uh, okay, I need to a little bit explain. From most of my opinions about this game, I was uh, a bit blind. Mainly because I didn't use guns. Or actually... I sort of did. 
what happened is that uh, when the game came out of beta, performance tanked. For a year straight, playing this game... In, uh, ridiculous. Like, you even uh, saw previously. There was like a recording from a live stream, I think. Where just the... I would have one frame per second. How am I supposed to shoot my gun with that? You can't. So, I just stopped using my gun. After I got a cool graphics card, which I'm using to this day, I started using my gun, but suddenly, wait a second, I can't just like kill people like I used to before Parabellum. And like, wow, people are just killing me. What, why is that happening? Turns out I was playing on servers that weren't meant for me, and I was not really that good with guns, because I'm not... Like, I'm sorry, but I don't care about shooters. I like just... The reason why I played SL was not for shooting, it was for the everything in between like how you need to approach situations or like uh, uh, spawn wave like you need to s set up the uh, you need to ambush the chaos insurgency wave or something like that i was for that not shooting so yeah when i say that all things were casually differently yeah on my end probably they were but if i actually used the gun that would have probably I, I wouldn't say these words and in the next update, man, did the, did the thing get just difficult and annoying? Story Crap, I pressed the wrong button. Uh, are we doing this again? Before I started playing SL, I didn't play any games at all. I found myself playing SL less often. I don't know. I think I'm in dispense. I didn't want the mainstream and casual friendly, which I think is supposed to bring new players. But like, most people don't play this game because the main concept is too confusing and because you die. A lot. Because of that, I found myself playing SL less often. Okay, was that criticism good? That you shouldn't make SL more streamlined because it's already complicated. Huh. Actually, that's changed quite a lot because back then, yes, dying. Wow, you could wait for 10 minutes. Now, dying is like, okay, like you die, you just respawn, it's not that bad. Huh. But back then, was that a good criticism? But I'm not, I'm not actually sure. I can't think. Yeah, I guess... Uh, okay, it's difficult to approach this because... The way Norfolk approached SL changed during that time, so I'm not sure if we wanted old SL, this was a bad move. If you wanted a new SL, this was a good move. So, I, and I don't know. I think it's still a fun game and I'm not gonna become a Minecraft channel anytime soon, but outside of videos and streams I never really touch it. There isn't really a good end for this, I still feel like SL is kinda lacking in depth and I can't really do much about it. Man, did he not see what was coming. <laughs> also, by the way, I would like to say, no, that's no longer the case, I actually do play SL in my free time. With that said, this video isn't over yet, as I would like to take some time discussing other things. Look at I this young like boy. Look at this young lad with his piss walls. With his piss walls. Oh, I miss you, piss walls. No, I don't. Let's talk about the elephant in the room. Perform. I can already hear some people commenting. Oh, bad Norsewood can't fix the performance in a single update as it will take some time to change and fix different aspects of the game in order to increase a frame rate. Listen. I hear you. Oh yeah, crap, yeah, people actually, people, wow, back then, you, people complain that the SL fanbase is, defends Norfolk for everything. Back then, oh, oh, it, oh, it was a lot, it was a lot worse, okay? <laughs> it was like, no, it's fine, it's Norfolk, it's great, oh, especially the SL disco, that was so horrible. But no, piss off. Things were bad, okay? I don't care that it takes time. You've made the game, you've made the changes. I forgot one small little detail. I don't care. Okay, I literally said this here, but by the way, I think what I said right now was good. What I said back then was bad. I said the same thing, but back then I said, okay, I don't care about developers. Do this. That's not a good way of watching criticism.
but now like I say performance is bad fix the performance fix the issues and back then I had my concerns actually I think there were problem with guns I think that was the main problem back then and they took so long to even do anything about that I'm not sure if it was a problem with decals. No, I don't think it was. It was something with the netcode. And they took so long to do anything. Because Norfolk, just generally, they weren't really responsive. So, you know, I can't understand why I said I don't care. Because Norfolk didn't care either. But... Ah, no, that's not how you approach criticism. As a consumer, I don't care who is making the product and how. If it sucks, it just sucks. Okay, you are mean. I love this Steam controller. I still have it in my drawer. It's the best thing you can use. Okay, no, sorry. Tier list of controllers for FPS games. One, Steam Deck. Two, this thing. You have no idea. This is such an amazing product. Sucks. What am I going on about? SL sucks Wait, what was that text? What was that text? Sucks, it just sucks. Okay, I love your Steam controller. Yeah, that's what I thought. I love your Steam controller. SL sucks in performance. I have quite a decent computer. I can edit these little videos in Doritos Movie Maker without any issues. I can run many different modern and old Unity and non-Unity games at a steady frame rate. This thing kept, this was the most resource intensive scene in the entire video for some reason, I have no idea why. It ...while streaming. But SL is currently the only game that doesn't want to run smoothly on my com computer. I think it's the worst. Okay, by the way. There was like an entire saga of performance sucks videos coming. Actually, no, I think it was one. A lot of times I received criticism that, oh, well, maybe you should just update your computer. But no, SL was quite literally the only game that was running so horribly. I ran other games with anti-cheats. No, they were fine. But SL anti-cheat, because it was the anti-cheat in the end. It was so horrible. SL had the worst performance of any game that I owned, that I ever played. So no. Performance was a problem. From what I heard, it's still a problem, but I think it's now it's just HDRP being HDRP and not, you know, Norfolk just being ignorant. Because yes. Actually, no, they did do performance things. They did, did things for performance in the game. Outside of the game, they didn't really do anything, and that was the problem. Worse with weapons. Sniper scopes now use two cameras instead of one, which, as you can tell, made... Oh yeah, another, another thing, like, Norfolk just wants to do cool things. Uh, especially back then, they worked sort of like Steam, that people do cool things. They don't really do what would be important. They just do what they want to do. So, yeah, cool, you have two cameras. Yeah, that's realistic. Not many games do this. For a reason. Because this is so performance intensive. And guess why I didn't use sniper scopes. And honestly, there still should be an option to just disable double cameras. Makes the frame rate, uh, let's just say. Actually, no crap. Wait. Huh. How are they doing this? Okay, so, in context, there's one camera rendering the game. The thing that you see, the uh, warhead. One for the hands and the gun weapon. And one for the thing that gets displayed in the scope. In HDRP, that's a death sentence. How did they manage to do this? Men. I just... Wait, is that why the game is unoptimized? <laughs> that, that, that'll be funny. But in, in defense of Norfolk, these are such basic features that just Unity refuses to... I mean, they don't refuse. They are just... I don't know. Unity is generally dumb. I hate Unity so much, and they probably hate Unity so much too. Less than stellar. And bullet holes exist. And so, by the way, on that clip, I remember I died. I had the perfect ambush in all the cell that would have worked, but it didn't heal. And I was so frustrated. Like, why didn't this work? Like, it used to, this used to work. Why doesn't it work anymore? One frame rate. Two new guns. Now there's so much things to them that you cannot just do this and it will magically work. You require skill, of which I didn't have, because I didn't have the frames to get that skill. And so I was playing against, like, the, the wrong people. Like, you know, they were fine people, like, I'm, I'm not saying they were, like, horrible, but they were playing the game for a different reason. Whenever they get created, they cause a lot of lag.
So turns out you can actually disable bullet holes in the settings, but the game is still laggy when you're shooting your guns so I just don't know by this point. But I still think there should be a separate toggle for bullet holes because turns out that if you disable decals you get a competitive disadvantage because you cannot see one of six's portals. This got me killed multiple times. There should also be a separate toggle for blood because, well, blood phobia is real and you can't just fix it by saying man up to somebody. You I would like to report that that happened. And by the way, I was not. A lot of people like say, oh, "Why, why are you blood phobia? Oh man, which by the way, that no, that's not how it works. But the reason I was making this argument was not because I actually cared about people with blood phobia. Actually, it's blood phobia. Well, blood phobia, hemophobia. What? What am I talking about? Blood phobia. That's not the word. I just made that up. Uh, yeah, the main reason was that in all the cell, I used to be really frustrated. All the cell blood was so ugly. You do not even know it. It was a lot worse than it is now. I swear, if it turns out that I never changed the, the look of the blood, then I will look like an absolute idiot. But I remember being really frustrated with that. And even when you, like, uh, there was a slider with amount of blood. When you dragged it to the left for zero, there was still blood, and I was so mad, because I didn't want blood. So that's what I was complaining about here. I just don't want blood, because it looked bad. It's real, and you can't just fix it by saying man up to somebody. You know, ju just saying, w would be nice if you could actually allow us to modify the game, so we could actually fix those things instead of putting... But, you know, I, di I digress, I, I think... Hmm. That's another interesting... I had a lot of problems with attitude, like... I wanted to mod a cell. Actually, no. It was even more selfish than that. I wanted to have the option of modding a cell, not that I would actually do it. Actually, be before problem, I did actually think about modding a cell, but I thought, oh no, because that's cheating, or like, oh, it will be detected. But then I realized, oh, wait a second, there was no anti-cheat back then. Actually, there was anti-cheat, but it was really easy to bypass. So yeah, not, I, it's not like I lost something with Parabellum. I, I mean, I lost frame rate and then money, but uh, and and I, and I guess a good game. <clears throat> I don't like Parabellum, but uh, yeah, I think for a multiplayer game, yeah, I think that's sadly a devil we'll have to deal with. Anti cheats suck, but they do work. You could see. A game like SCP Event Classified, which was supposed to be like an SO clone. There's no one playing right now. I can tell you that. At most, there will be four people playing. And they are probably doing it offline, just testing and trying to break the game more. Because that thing did not have any anti-cheat. Originally, there were a lot of issues at launch. And it didn't have anti-cheat. There are so many cheaters. So yes, sadly, as much as I hate it. We do need SLAC. You just like to, although this like is a nice image, making the game better because, like you know, anti cheats, uh, they they won't stop hackers, but they will just stop normal users. That's true. But a lot of, but sorry, most of most hackers are regular users. When someone wants to hack, they will find a way. You cannot stop them. I can tell you that. No matter what kind of kernel, kernel kernel level anti cheat you're running, people will find a way. So the reason why we have anti cheats is that it's, it, it's more difficult. Suddenly you need to know where to look and you need to sometimes pay. So when we have an anti cheat, suddenly most people can't be bothered, so they just don't do it. From modding the game. Yeah. If you don't know, I stop using guns because there isn't even a point in trying. But when I use them, I always notice the same thing. The crosshair and accuracy is whack. If you stand and zoom, you have pinpoint accuracy. If you start running, toy gun. This game has turned into a tactical shooter, which is fine, but this is ridiculous. I'm not sure about now, but I think this has gotten a lot better. Which, yeah, I always felt like that's just wrong. Like, why? Why? Do I need to always point a gun in a game where I am running away from SCPs? I can't do that. 
I'm afraid to fart while using these things because I'm scared that the wind could destabilize my grip. The crosshair also doesn't make much sense as well. There is some software. How oh, long live the Amogus? Um, the Amogus. Ah. Already available that adds virtual crosshairs and people will figure out how to mark the center of their screen outside of the computer, no matter if you like it or not. My okay. I agree with this still. I think most games should have at least like a dot in the middle. Because yes, you can get an advantage by just using a monitor like this. So it's really dumb to like just not add this, okay? People do want a point at the middle of their screen. So like, you know, it's just, you, it's not it's something that you can't stop, so just embrace it. My monitor even comes with something like that built in. What is the point of making it more horrible for people for no reason? And I understand a slight offset, but not completely going out of the screen for crying out loud. If you are new to this channel, I live in Poland. And no, nobody cares that you also live in this country. Shut up. So of course, the server list puts the poly- Let's make a game about SCP. Also, Northwood focuses on being hyper-realistic. I mean, most SCP games do that. Like, that's not exclusive to Northwood. I was actually surprised that no, that SL was so sci-fi at the beginning. Like so many STP games are trying to be so realistic. Oh yeah, we have cool guns and we have... Containment Breach wasn't actually that realistic if you think about it. I mean, they had like guns, but you know, bad graphics and like... In one ending, there's micro HID being fired. Like, oh cool, yeah. Yeah, I know, I was just memeing. Other servers on the top, which... Well, makes sense. But often I don't want to play on Polish servers for many different reasons. Should be easy. I can use. Oh crap, Parabellum! Oh no, uh, back then. Polish servers. Oh boy, there's so many kids. Th there's still a lot of kids playing on Polish servers, but now they've actually grown up. Back then, so many squeakers. If you hated them, no point in playing. Go to England. I'm sorry, lad. I really like playing with kids because I'm firstly I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> uh, that's a joke. Mm. We are not following in the footsteps of that one lad. Uh, the I really like playing because like they weren't or actually no they were quite good with guns, but I think just back then guns were easy so that expected. But they weren't really smart so it was I was sort of cheating let's say. That's what we were called tryharding. Tryharding if you don't know how to try hard. You just go to a server with a bunch of children that don't know how to play video games. <laughs> My life hack. And yeah, uh, about search list, I still agree. There should be more options. Even like right now, let me choose the language that people speak. You have no idea how annoying this is. Actually, do, add that to settings so that I can select what languages I speak. So that I only go, get these servers. Because every time I search up US and I get Russian servers, I don't care. Use the search bar and search for US and... Exactly, that still happens. Oh, that's right. Not only that the search bar is broken, there isn't a proper way to filter servers by region, language, player size, number of people playing currently or on average, nothing. Not even if they allow killing on site nor any other basic rules. Can I team? Does it have a modded map? Does it have custom classes and more? I can see the last part being difficult to implement, but once again, I don't care. And we Terrible of po saying that. Also, did I hear correctly that Norfolk is reworking respawn? Again? Oh, you mean, oh, you mean right now? I don't know. I don't know, they really, they really like reworking their respawn waves. <laughs> uh, yeah. I still support this. Although maybe not as much because literally every single time I stream I search up for UK servers. There's not a single one active. I don't know what's going on. England, get your garbage together. But man, yeah, Norfolk, this is useful. Add this. Add this. Or I can see the last part being difficult to implement, but once again, I don't care. Shut and up. I don't have any favorite servers. I what am I supposed to- how can I pick the right server? The server list is preventing me from- Okay, I still like really agree with this, is that SL is so difficult to f get into because you need to find the right server that makes it fun. That's why you have so many tryhards because official servers, which is probably the first choice for every beginner, were just really sweaty. 
And thus, the result is this. If people were actually joining casual servers, I think I still wouldn't be in the place that is currently. Although, yes, Norfolk did actually change a lot of things to make it more about just, you know, aim and K2Ds and things like that. But still, like, yeah, like, honestly, uh, matchmaking or just like a qu quick server finder that I want a casual experience. And then, like, there will be software running on uh, every, like, SL server that will determine if people are playing competitively or not. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. From playing the game. Who coded this? This is the new design that was developed by so many different people. While the original concept that was made by just one person was exactly the same. But somehow I thought it was better while recording this part. But somehow it's not implemented. Okay. I had one game when I was so often I'm playing a rework, me, me, me cry, rework, and somehow won. Had to bend the rules of the server a bit. Eh, whatever. Okay, uh, by the way, no, th this is not actually like looking back at my criticism. This is not criticism. I was just, I was whipping off Tantacruel. I wanted to get angry on, on a video because that's entertaining. But I realized that, wait, crap, I, when I was editing, I had to like throw footage of the old server uh, list. Wait, crap, there was absolutely no point to this, but I just kept it in anyway. <laughs> God, I reached that. Oh, I already reached eight minutes. No, oh, that's sad. Oh. And I guess finally I can talk about those little things which are too small for their own segment, but I think they still should be talked about. When I Let's press see. play, I have to select if I want to play or reset my settings. Because how could the game know what I want it to do? Okay, honestly, I know a lot of games did that back then. But yeah, that sucked. But Steam fixed it by making it so that you can just select one option and always select it every time you boot up the game. So thanks Steam, doing the things that North would want. <laughs> Currently, the audio menu lets you change voice chat and sound effects volume. There isn't an option for Cassie, Ambient, Spectator wow, voice chat, yeah. STP voice chat, Guns. I would really appreciate that one. Okay, like I was mainly here talking about Guns because holy garbage, they were so incredibly loud back then. I think they still are, but Guns are loud, sorry. Uh, I know a lot of people didn't like this because they thought, well, you know, like it's a... Ta like uh, you... Making so that you can mute Cassie would kind of make it more overpowered for you because you could hear more things while the announcing was going off. And I remember that people were using Cassie to like, uh, move to a different place without actually being heard. I don't know, I still like having the option. Or mainly because uh, that, uh, for example, when I'm recording, I want to mute certain things. Which, by the way, I was later shown that you can actually apply an effect which removes ambient sound. But it's an effect and it's limited. And I... But guess who showed me that effect? Think of any controversial YouTuber from the secret laboratory community. Yep, that was him. That I've acquired knowledge from a groomer. That's... Mm. One in particular, you know. Why Thanks for that. Screw you. Why can't I change my settings right in game? The actual place where you can test out how the graphics. Oh, that is like fine milk. No, fine wine. Fine. What do you mean milk? That is like fine wine. Let's look and what the performance. Even North would like this. So like, oh, this disgusting video. It's so terrible. It's he's so dumb and they're like, <gasps> wait. He has a point. And I had a point, man. It was so frustrating even back then because I knew you could quite literally control C, control V in Unity. There are prefabs. You can have the same thing in two different places, but just North would have two different menus. It was so annoying. And you won't let me change anything. Also, in the normal settings menu, you can select many full screen modes, while in game you only have a toggle, which nobody knows what it does. And oh, yeah, that sucked. Oh, that sucked. Other thing. Why isn't there an option for model detail? I know, I know, I. Yeah, that's... I cried about the settings a lot, but they are important. Especially when your game's performance is a joke. Okay, to be quite honest, I don't like. I don't think that's that important these days. Most games don't even expose this, but back then, we were desperate, okay? Performance was so terrible. Like this. Lag. This. 
For the love of... By using the con slave, my... I died in that clip, by the way, later. But I, but I cut that part out because it was too long. Much too other toggle for using voice chat. I often use it while spectating, as I don't want to hear spectators and people that I am spectating. Sadly, there still isn't an option to do this natively in the game. Okay, what was I smoking here? You found a fix for problem. You complain that the pro that, that it doesn't exist. I, I, what am I complaining here about? I know this was such a niche use case. I think I was just trying to find points for the video and I ran out of them. But yeah, Norfolk once again said, huh, that's an interesting idea. And they've actually added that for some reason. Norfolk, stop listening to me. Or especially, no, no listen to me, but not to this garbage. This lad is drunk, okay? Game. Also, please add more console commands. Change setting, change input, CMD bind. These are stolen from my own tool. Oh, what a sellout. CMD bind clear. Okay, that's a, that was actually useful. I used to use CMD bind. I don't... And yeah, there was no way of clearing it, which was a bit annoying. I think. Arias. Uh, yeah, this was just... Yeah, I wanted to have commands. <laughs> And I was really into like, uh, if you didn't hear from the video, I had a shortcut for muting and unmuting the voice chat. We are complaining to make it easier for people who don't know how CMD works. Oh no, don't worry. Uh, I wasn't. I was being selfish there. I was. Just, I, that, that was literally... I just had to add something. Like, it's not... You can't complain about something saying that this feature doesn't exist. And this niche feature doesn't exist, that's why the game is bad. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. I tried defending myself in the comments, I had no point. Remote admin sucks. In my opinion, certain actions can be performed faster with a command, while others are better off with a graphical interface. Sadly, there isn't a simple button to switch between those two. Okay, this, we still don't have a button for switching, but I think the remote admin has gotten a lot better. And especially, I don't feel the need of using a console because it's a lot easier to find things now. Just go to the server. Oh, yeah. Like, we have segregation here. This was a mess, honestly. This was a mess to navigate. And I was recording for videos, because that's my main complaint here. When I was recording for videos, I had to frequently start a server, go to remote admin, spawn myself as this class, and record something. And it was so annoying to keep doing this every single time. I still feel like there's some things that could be important. For example, when you type in... When a command requires you to type in uh, the ID of a player, just like show me a list of players, or actually no, make it so the console doesn't occupy this entire space. Make this thing still show up, so that I could ju just here replace this with the console, but have the player list here. You have no idea how useful that would be. Wow! Or you could like select things here, and then you could type in a command like uh, you know, I don't know force class, and then you uh, use at to select everything that's selected in the hierarchy, like at H, for example, and at A would be uh, all, at uh, P would be the closest player to you, and things like that. I'm whipping off Minecraft, but that would be useful. Man, you can still make the remote admin a lot better. To mode with my keyboard. Oh, I don't know. Tap, for example? I think you could do that. I forgot to mention, but autocomplete doesn't suggest... What a lot, you have a microphone, just record the thing. Why are you using text to speech? You know... It was even like more annoying to record text to speech. Why didn't I just record it with a microphone? It would take 10 seconds. Things like player names, room names, or other specific things. This is the only Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I agree with that. Only reason why I think graphical GUI is better in certain scenarios. Okay, that's great, but once again, why are you saying one thing and then backpedaling five seconds later? And as you might know, the base client console doesn't have any fancy suggestions or anything. Oh, yeah. There are two consoles anyways. Can't you just make one that is good? Additionally, good point. Actually, I think it's quite interesting to separate two consoles, one for remote administration and one for the client. But I think there should be like more things similar there. Because the base client console acts a little bit different from remote admin. And I think they should be more similar to each other. I can't navigate away with my keyboard. This thing just feels really clunky to use with a mouse. Actually... Hey man, now it isn't that bad, but still, I, I think keyboard navigation... Keyboard navigation sucks, generally, in Unity. But man, it would be really handy. When I think about it, I can't navigate anything with my keyboard. Would be nice to have a tutorial.
The reason for that is that Norfolk could not be bothered, and I can understand that. Okay? Unity navigation. Trash. Holy crackers. For this game, so I wouldn't have to explain the entire universe lore for my friends to play with me. Or a friend list or something like that. Do you know how? How many people there are who just want to play with their friend and not, oh, I don't know, against their friend? Why is this stamina about? I don't think, yeah, I, I don't really think about that. Mainly because I don't have any friends anymore. But I also like see it quite common to just hop on a voice chat with someone and not play together. Like, that's fine. Honestly. But yeah, no, the, the second part doesn't matter. The first part that there should be a tutorial. I will be happy to operational <laughs> Mom, we, 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 have oper we have tutorial at home. <laughs> but I still, uh, tutorial can be improved in a cell, I think. Norfolk also thinks that. I mean, I watched like an interview and Hubert said like, or maybe like, uh, you know, they could include videos in a cell. I think that's still a crappy solution for that. But what can you do? I think like something like the Deep Rock uh, manual. That would be great. Back still here. It's been I would like someone so that they just hire stupid Etra. Etra for uh, games for non gamers. I've I've worked with this lad actually. Can I find it? He dedicated his entire life to make it so that his mother can play video games. Uh, crap. Wait, he even shouted me out uh, somewhere uh, because I made a tool for him. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, here! Hey, old Doc Frankenstein made a wonderful video above! Of course I did! Operational guide, exactly. This lad is so dedicated. He, make, he makes spreadsheets of how people interact with games that don't know how to play games. I want someone that dedicated at Norfolk trying to make the best tutorials that everyone could understand. Even my grandma, my grandma is dead. Even my mother could play a cell. That's the dream. You reported so long ago and you still haven't fixed it after so many updates. A lot of menus are using the default Unity sprites for UI. Nothing screams professionality more than this eyesore. Balance I agree. Norfoot, get your garbage together. I have an entire UI video about that. You might think I had actual criticism there. Nah. The main point? If I the main point of this video? I hate default Unity buttons. Okay, I'm joking actually, but yeah. Norfolk, for the love of. I want to say I play cool video games and then I have to show this thing to my friends. Like, come on. Step up your game. The balance of the game can vary quite often depending on the player count. This means that if there's more people playing, it becomes harder to dodge SCPs and thus harder to survive. Also, the match. Okay, uh. Don't change this. Mainly because I want to have control over the game. I want to play on a smaller server and have fun. I don't want you to ruin that with some matchmaking. Or sorry, uh, matchmaking. I don't want to ruin that with random balancing that some SCPs are more difficult or the facility is smaller or bigger on these servers. Let me have that level of control. I don't believe. Okay, I respect them for the lot of ways. I don't think they could handle that. Because as I said, no, SL cannot be balanced. Let me retain this level of control. Thank you. Maker doesn't really see the difference between such combos as 173 plus 096 and 2939s. Okay, honestly, yeah, I think they should still do something like that. Or actually, should they? Because it creates more variety, but on the other hand, it's also a little bit unfair when you have, you know, 079 and 17. No, actually, that combo isn't that bad these days, but 096 and 173. Like, make that thing just a duo that cannot ever happen. Just remove 096, amen. SCP chats can be really annoying. Especially when there's a bunch of zombies who just scream about how they died or start using their industrial sized fan. Would be nice to be able to mute them or silence them or just remove their human rights. Am I really asking for yes. too much? S uh, okay, so what I wanted there is to just... My idea here, I'm not sure if I said that there, I wasn't really listening to myself. My idea was that 049 could hear zombies and everyone else. I guess this is a complaint for bigger servers. On small servers, for example, like the ones that we played on today, that's not a problem. On big servers, yeah, that's it. Especially official ones. Oh, man. I misclicked my bind. What are you 
smoking SCP-079, an SCP which can take away your way of escaping a situation. Whenever I get locked inside the room, I don't think to myself, oh, I should have gone there, or I should have been more careful. No, I just say, well, this sucks. And as of record, I still think it's really frustrating to play against 079, but it's gotten a lot better, and I think at its current state, I am able to put with this, put up with this, at least with how I play, because once again, I start playing on smaller servers, finally, and on big servers, it could, it could vary. My opinions can be completely misaligned from the general public. I'm fully aware of that. In this video, Northwood showcased their new soft reward version of 79, but it still doesn't take away from the fact that you can be locked in a room with an SCP for multiple seconds. I oh yeah, that, that update sucked, by the way. I am an experienced player. I know exactly what my objective is. And I am an experienced player. Oh, shut up. You are not. Oh, I am just by seeing the color. So it would be nice to disable or make the intro text smaller or faster so it wouldn't take up my entire screen while I need to look around and see what's around me. The okay, uh, I still think that. I think with uh, 13 point, uh, with Parabellum, this was a lot worse because the game was a lot darker. So when you have a big white thing covering your screen, it's already difficult to see without a giant uh, uh, sign in front of my eyes. It's gotten a lot better because now the game is ridiculously bright. But let's see, I think uh, end of uh, round screen and uh, you are intro screen they should honestly be reworked because they look so just i don't know temporary loading screen never reaches 100 percent this is because oh yeah that's the thing of how unity handles scene loading so normally you should divide this value by 0.9 this is not the case here and finally just don't use the muscle booster amen i'm not sure about the attachments because you know so it's so difficult to test out anything because you need to be at your A game all of the time. You do not have time for experimentation. So I'm not sure. I remember when Parabellum came out, Muzzle Booster, garbage. Everybody trashed Muzzle Booster. Not sure about how it is now. And yeah, loading screen. I fi did they fix that? I'm not sure. If they didn't, you suck Norfolk. And you suck so much that you've made me used to having 90% instead of 100%. Literal Bracky's tutorial on how to make a loading screen says to divide it by 0.9. How dare you? This is quite a risky video for me to make because since I make games, it will be quite awkward not to live up to what I just said. This is just my. Okay, uh, this may not make sense, but yes, I really. I tried so hard to not make videos like this because I know when you critique something and then you make something, a lot of people will hold your own like points. To the thing you've made but you've got to understand it's a completely different process when you're making something you're solving a lot of like small problems and you're like really focused on it so sometimes you cannot see things even my videos i think this one sucks okay no it is good i there are a lot of faults with it which i didn't notice i thought it was amazing at first but it took me a long time to finally like look at it with a fresh set of eyes like realize what i was talking about I'm rambling without much thought put into it because I'm not making the game and I'm not getting paid to think rationally. I'm just giving suggestions. Most of them are probably wrong. Do with them what you want. I mean, I don't... Okay. Uh, me not being able to say what I want, so I need to throw a big text at the screen. Love that. These are the things I want to change, but that doesn't mean that they are good for the game. That the majority of the player base would even want them. Event. Would... You may... These days, I am annoyed by people like this lad right here. You have so much time to fix these things, but you say no. I am going to use text to speech instead of just saying things with my microphone. I am just going to follow this text instead of re-recording things, which you know, YouTube is a different beast. I, I can understand why people do this. You are in a rush you to get out things quickly. Uh, for me, that's not really a problem because my upload schedule is beautiful. It's seven months. What? I saw there was like a. Okay, I thought I was a year old to this. Uh, a year late. So uh, that this video is a year old, but no. Okay, that's good. That's good. We're we're on schedule. We're on schedule. 
know that full well. I am translating manga into Polish on one side, and later I, I or other people will find errors in my translations. Yeah, but like I watched the video. Why didn't I fix? That? Ah, you have no idea how many times I check things these days. Because I also need to replay them a bunch of times because of how large the videos have gotten. Holy garbage! Why did I ever start this? I don't anticipate anybody seeing this video, but like, who cares? With that said, thank you for watching. I am going to continue working on my Instagram. Goodbye. Oh, this is true. So sad. Oh, I clicked the wrong button again. Oh, oh the SL clone. Ah, it wasn't really an SL clone. It was just like an SL like. I didn't want to make it even an STP. Uh, uh uh Okay, so I think Recently, we should really speed around for so this video. No, I think it's gonna take too long, and I remember just being mad about performance here. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm just complaining about performance. Why am I even watching this? And it's this video. Actually, no, I do want to watch through this video. I'm not so sure how long it will take. Don't care. I want to look for this video. It's one thousand dollars on a stupid Unity game. Hi. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You wanted to have that for video editing. I know you. But it was a good clickbait, wasn't it? <laughs> Actually, yeah, the, I didn't really want to buy a GPU. I was holding off on it. But then I realized, okay, I'm stream as cell, but I stream it in one frame per second. I need to fix this. So that was the thing that actually pushed me over. But the first thing... But uh, the first reason why I decided to buy a graphics card was because I wanted to do video editing in DaVinci, which it absolutely did not like my previous graphics card. I'm not even sure why, it was like a, I don't know, decent 1650 super. I really enjoy playing this little game called SCP Secret Laboratory, or at least I think I do. You see, it has gotten really slow recently, and it sometimes takes me up to an hour to render a single frame. Thus, I can't get myself into any action, use guns, or... My nose was clucked in that, in that moment, okay? There's something in my nose there. I can hear that. I can hear that. My inner IT technician has been awakened. <laughs> Even run away from enemies. My friends keep telling me that I should start playing some other game that is less confusing and is actually playable. But I'm sure they're just jealous. I have no idea how we ended up here. <laughs> I started that was a good intro. I really like that intro. I started playing before Scopophobia and everything was running almost slightly below average. Then the Parabellum Beta... Okay, honestly, I had like 50 frames per second, or 60 even. Beta came, which gave me even more frames to work with. And oh yeah, that, that was beautiful, 70. Or even 80. Or even 90. And then, when it was released, the frame rate dropped, for some reason. Later, in another update, they've added a new feature called Random Lag Spikes that only happen to you, and only when you're in a tense situation. LAG! FOR THE LOVE OF! That was quite common back then, even for people that had normal computers. We were... oh yeah. Oh, the more frustrating thing is that Northwood probably took their longest break. Or actually, not the longest break, but they left the game. It's completely broken for a year, and it was a lot worse than just lag spikes and terrible performance, okay? There were people from that... hold up, no. A right banana. Will we find the video? Will we find the video? By the way, I like his videos. <laughs> I, I'm glad that he still makes videos. I don't think he likes me anymore. <laughs> for, for a certain reason. Mm. Crap, it was like an older video. Uh, uh, no, no. No, he made like a, during Parabellum. I think this is post. I think this is no. Uh, uh, okay, so basically, there was a lot of YouTubers were dropping out from the game back then. Uh, because you could, depending on your system, you could be completely desynced, or more like you, tele the elevators would not work, you could not hear other people, you could not pick up items, and you would just like walk. And there was no fix for that. I remember playing on a CPS on now that laptop, it was a good laptop, blah 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 blah, blah 48 FPS in game. When people got mad, Northwood responded by not updating the game for a year. Luckily, exactly. Luckily, with the memory beta, they've removed random lag spikes, they decided <laughs> to keep the terrible frame rate Beautiful for balance reasons. But luckily, yeah. I had a lot of money saved up, so I've decided to upgrade my computer. I've bought myself a new, shiny RTX 4070, which has cost me 600... 30! 70! Actually, I think I did say 30, but it's not like 4070. It wasn't even released 
when that video came out. 30. 30, 70. 3070. I've also had to spend money on a new power supply because the old one was too weak. This required me to replace all of the German cables in my computer to these black, slick, and very difficult to bend ones. Okay, crap. Uh, okay, I remember this. I was trying to sell this as a complaint on Norfolk, but I had to replace my power supply with bulky cables. Like, man, okay. What was I smoking? I know it doesn't... You can like say, oh, that's not what I meant. No, I did mean that. I did mean that. I remember that. You liked that, okay? Mr. Cock Frankenstein from a year ago. You liked replacing those cables. Do not lie to me. And after hours of hard labor, this was the result. <laughs> I said, I said... Amen. Okay, let me get this straight. I've upgraded my computer with one of the most powerful and expensive graphics cards out there, and I get this. What? You see, SL is not only demanding graphically, but also computationally. And turns out my CPU is old. You might say, you have an old CPU, tough luck. But it's not that bad. I do not have any other application or game on my computer that has an issue with it. So Again! So many comments under this video were saying, oh, you should just upgrade your CP. Literally in the same video, I showed you many proofs of why SL was an exception. It wasn't that I only played SL and it sucked. No, I played other games. They run fine. So another $200 later, I have a CPU. And this time I even received it in a box with a cooler. By the way, thanks for that, Allegro. T Today we fix computer. However, computer... Sign something, I don't have all the montage. Good sign. So turns out this website is lying and I have to update my BIOS and oh, take yeah, it was. my computer for the fourth time just so that maybe, with a bit of luck and isopropyl alcohol, I could have two additional frames in a cell. If this game is in a mental illness, then I don't know what is. Here we are, ladies and gentlemen. It is, it is, it is, it is, it is. And gentlemen, <laughs> now it's time to witness something that only a few people on this planet will be able to experience. 50 frames per second. <laughs> Literally best hardware that I could get at the time. 60 frames per second. He's dead. He's dead. You thought I was gonna have 200 frames or something like that? Nah, this is a sell. And for the first time ever, I was able to stream with a consistent frame rate and even enjoy the game like I used to in the past. Hmm? No, you didn't. That was a fluke. Okay. Mm. It took me a really long time to figure out how to make a sell enjoyable. I know your intentions, and I do not like that. <gasps> is it. That thing sucked. It still sucks. No, this gun from 45. It's a terrible it gun. Sucks, honestly. Yeah. Well, it will appear like you died. No, the other way. I think that is music. That's a good question. Was there a bar behind me? Oh, what is this guy about you? That was garbage, okay? That was garbage, I tell you. Stupid camping dog. Ah, why do you have what do you mean anti class sucks? It's ridiculously good now. Full cool HP, this doesn't make sense. See, shit. that's what I'm talking about. That's what, what I was fuck? trying to achieve this whole time. But we ain't done yet. You see, I am a curious being, and throwing money at a problem doesn't really satisfy me. A lot of people have different theories about why game no work, so let's go over some of them. Unoptimized models. No. Most new models in SL have different LOD levels, and the old containment breach garbage doesn't really eat up as many resources as you would think. Not to mention there's a whole culling system in place, so your computer doesn't calculate rooms that you're not likely to see. Lighting and shadows. 
Eh, uh, sort of. I mean, it certainly doesn't help, but from my testing, the difference wasn't that great. Here, once again, summing out of people said, Oh, you should just use something. Brother in Christ. Didn't fix anything. Until Cola good? I don't know, I haven't played the game that much. I enjoyed it with, with Anti Cola. Uh, yeah. And also, uh, from the unoptimized moves, I think it's a part of that, but I. Northwood could optimize those models. But they don't. Because the, probably the way that it's set up, it would be probably more easier to just outright replace them than to, like, fix them. So that's probably the reason why we'll say that they are unoptimized models. Bullet holes and decals. No. I thought this was the main cause for a long time, because at the start of the round... And the reason why my performance wasn't really that affected was because that there's a lot of, like, cooling f technologies now in SL. The, the way you can... Treat as that is when you go to surface zone, the entire thing is loaded all the time. That's when the uh, frame rate drops. The game doesn't lag that much. However, after 20 spawn waves and 4 billion dead bodies sprinkle around the facility, it gets a bit slow. Sadly, if you disable decals, the lag stays. Ragdolls? No. You can enable ragdoll cleanup time and once again, lag stays. Unity? No, shut up. Bad code? No somehow. After the recent and not so recent updates, a lot of code has been rewritten. And the frame rate has gotten worse, so coincidence? Okay, I, okay, I, I no agree idea. with most of this. The only other reason I can think of is having a lot of items on the ground from dead bodies, but once again, I may be proven wrong for the 20th time. I'm starting to wonder if Unity has a hard-coded check that if your game is named scp Secret Laboratory, it just bottlenecks the performance. Or maybe True. Northwood has an agreement with Nvidia, Intel, or some other company True. to purposely Again. slow their game down so that people will buy more RTX. This is true. As you can see, it clearly worked. I refuse to believe that they are not keeping the frame rate so low. For By so the way, my face. I love this thing. Uh, you have no idea how happy I am that now my videos take a ridiculous amount of time because I haven't enough time like prepare my face to not explode because it likes doing that i just need to find the moment where it doesn't detonate itself and like yes i can record and i quickly record everything <laughs> that's my that's my life hack currently it's it's sort of okay i don't know like I, as i'm saying my face just randomly explodes due to my skin being a joke well, at least i'm not as you know unfortunate as uh Right, banana was because he was. We don't know. Um, he like used to make SL videos. We still make videos, but not about SL. He has like really, really big issues of skin to the point like he wouldn't be able to move. It's like th that, uh, I'm not as bad, but generally like my skin just auto self destructs on itself. So malicious intent. I mean, they are not getting any money from this. One grand! You know how much Patreon money that is? I have recently purchased the beta, but I've decided to cancel my subscription, even though I wanted to see the new 096 Patreon post, because I literally spent too much money on this game already. Okay, I don't remember if that was actually true. I like to make up a lot of misinformation back then, but yeah, I think I did actually want to buy the beta. And I was just like, oh no, I shouldn't, I already spent enough money on this thing. So I think this is actually true. Ready. You know what, Norfoot? If you release the performance update tomorrow, I will give you 1,000 schmackeronis immediately. Oh wait, never mind, because I spent it already on my computer! Okay, I was rather harsh throughout this whole video, but... No, you weren't. Don't get me wrong. Norfoot are actually quite competent. Mimicry has made itself feel like a real video game with actual thought put into it and 173. Amen, so it amen. always was a mess. It always had a lot of junk, and the only thing keeping it together was duct tape, spit, and a prayer to God. Updating a game like this is a challenge on its own. Look at Splitgate. That thing got cancelled because the code was trash. Most people just immediately cut their losses and move on to create a sequel or something completely new. But they've persisted, and now they are slowly starting to release updates at a reasonable pace. Like okay, I am still like surprised as soon as a thing. If you look how it was made, wow. Why? Why does it exist? It should have died. I still believe SL should have died a long time ago. Why does it still exist? Like, it must have been a nightmare to release updates for this thing. While not committing... That's why most of the f like first updates just absolutely did nothing. And just like, we fixed networking.
by side too often. And some kind of performance update is just unrealistic. People expect new features, adjustments and changes. You can't just dedicate an entire year to making the game run better. Sure, more people will be able to play the game, but at that point it might be too late. One day, Amen. a single <laughs> can turn into something great, with incredible graphics, gameplay and maybe even performance. But before we get there, we will suddenly have to deal with all of this nonsense. In my YSL... Okay, now you're being too positive, like... Come on, say it! SL performance sucks! Amen! Stop, stop backpedaling! It's a bad video, I've said it at the end that most Have of... Have some balls, comment to your opinion! The things I said are probably wrong, and that I don't care about developers when saying this. Because if we don't do that, then all we will be able to say is that everything is okay. But it's not okay. This level of optimization is unacceptable, no matter your history, reasons and explanations. Last time I complained about performance, a lot of people said, But it works on my computer! When your computer is not shipped with the game now, is it? I Thank you for being loud that literally can run any other game out there just for a single title. But for the time being, not much is gonna change. The game will keep running terribly and it might even get worse in the future. But that's the thing you get when you want to play SL. Instead of spending money on SL, you can spend it on some kind of addiction. And yes, you might get lung cancer, be 20 million dollars in debt, or say goodbye to your <laughs> <little. laughs> 20... sorry. 20 mi million dollars in debt. Oh yeah, that's where I invest. <laughs> you see, I'm a deep individual. <laughs> But at least you will get some fun out of it for like a second. Because with a cell, we only get misery. Anyways, I'm gonna go play Portal RTX now because my computer can now do ray tracing. Also, my portal is full of cum. I don't know why. Why is my portal full of cum? GLaDOS explain what did you do. Now I need to think, I need to think what I think of the graphics. Piss off Lady Gladdy. Laddy gladdy. Laddy that's such gladdy. a that's, terrible that's now. man. I'm so oh, annoying here. So nice. I'm so annoying. Oh, that's not. Yeah, Portal RTX was a mod, okay? What did he do to Glados? Numero uno. This is like this. Uh, you don't need to say what's wrong, okay? I think we know. That man is floating. What's the command for spawning airboats? Hold up. Th create airboat. Yes! Airboat! Let's go! I am playing legit right now. Uh, please don't mind the Half-Life overlay. This is really strange to see. So, that was interesting. And where is my frame rate? Thank you. Did it actually just crash? I guess I'm stuck with SL for the rest of my life. Oh crap. I... Crap. Polish. Uh, that was a decent video, I must say. Uh, I think like with most of these, from this to the, actually to the end of all, on my old opinions, I had really, I really struggled with expressing my opinions and like forming opinions generally throughout my life. I mean, that's, you know, sort of the, the thing that happens when you grow up. When you are growing up. And, uh, yeah, like, sometimes I sort of don't know how to say something, or sometimes I just completely think the wrong thing. And sometimes I would do this very terrible thing of manipulating the, uh, the argument, like making misinformation. But I do think... So I, I remember that I always tried, like, still grounding it in something. And I said this. Like, I, I could make up, for example, uh, misinformation on how I felt. For the sake of argument. But I wouldn't, like, facts. Like, I could find a single example of something that, that was possible. So, yeah, please, when you watch these old videos, take it with a grain of salt. Because I was really, I really apologize for that. I didn't really know how to, like, do this properly back then. I didn't really know how to, like, form opinions and how to present them and like that. Now I take a long time, too long time, and I have a lot of time to think about how to do things. By the way, this video finally surpassed this one, which for the longest time was so underperforming and I was so mad. I'm so happy about that. We're not gonna watch the rest of them because at this point, this is a terrible video. 
uh, I was overdoing it. Most of the old crap is just, I have such an annoying voice and I'm just so annoying and why would you ever watch me? And uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, have a nice day. Yay. This video has some... I would do make it differently these days. This video is good. Honestly, I think this video is good. It has some faults, as always, but... I think this is good. This is eh. This is good. Let's hope the next one is gonna be excellent. It's not gonna be excellent. I already know that I've messed up in a way that I cannot revert by this point, but... Ah, uh, we're not gonna think about that, because we're gonna end the stream. Thank you very... Where do I click? Thank you, every... Well, not here. Thank... Well, not... Thank you, everyone, for watching. It was nice seeing you. It was beautiful. Thank you for joining, everyone. <laughs> I am thinking of making a clips channel and making one of the first clips for that channel. The, the ones where I watch my old videos. Because I really want to have a clips channel, because I think that's a good way of, like, you know, promoting Twitch and the things I do here. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I know, it takes time. I think I'm just gonna do it. It's gonna be, like, extremely easy. I mean, it's easy content, pretty much. That's why I'm gonna do it. Because I need that. Because I don't know. Because my content is not easy. <laughs> Honestly, like, I sometimes just wish I would not have to spend so much time on video editing. Just making videos. I want to do other things in life, but I'm stuck with this. It's not even earning me money. You have no idea how just annoying it is. Or just how heartbreaking it is to, like, see other people just, I don't know, working a normal job. Getting money and buying things. I'm actively losing money on making videos. I have like 10 zwater, which is like $2 remaining until I get uh, uh, a, uh, money from YouTube, which would be my second paycheck from them. That will make up for just the microphone that I use. That I bought just for these videos. That's it. I spend money on boxes, on different props. Okay, do I actually spend money on props? I Most of them I, I tried making on my own. But yes, I do spend money on videos. This video, for example, is not gonna... But this video generally that I'm working on, it took really long time. And like, even software development, I had to do that. So yeah. I generally hate this. I hate I work so much. For so little. See ya, that. See ya. It's just my frustration with YouTube. Like, honestly. I, I think I've said this before. I will not be a YouTuber. One day there will be a final video of Doc Frankenstein when I will feel like it. It's gonna be it. I don't care. I hate YouTube. I hate this whole landscape. I hate how, like, people need to take sponsorships from companies that just... Most of them, the more they pay, the more malicious they are. So when you see an Opera GX ad, you know. You know. I just, yeah, I just hate YouTubing and like everything surrounding that. I just think it's disgusting, like how the entire ecosystem works. And just how like people are so enticed, like rush out videos. And not just make what they want to make, because that's what I used to watch. People that, that make things that they want to make. I make what I want to make right now. I don't want that to change. One day I will get tired of it, because that's the only thing currently driving me forward. And I want to have the option of just stopping, or changing, or doing anything. And not just to be, like, forced to do something I'm not really... Like, I was actually, no, do something that I'm not passionate about. Like, that, that happens. Sorry, that's life. But make something I'm not passionate about. Just be... But you know, small things, that's okay. Videos like this, I don't want that. But I do think about setting up, like, a patron or something so that you could, you know, support me in a better way than YouTube. 
just support the things that I make, because I don't only make videos, you know? I've been working on an app for a cell for a very long time. A year, actually. So, yeah. Like, I wish one day... I I'm planning to make a video not about a cell. I truly hope it will blow up. When I say blow up, I'm not meaning... One million, half million, whatever Minecraft YouTubers expect from their daily videos. 20,000 views. It will not give me much money. It will not give me much subscribers. Will it at least like show me that there are people that actually want to see this? Like, I think I'm a bit limited by just making SL videos. About this specific topic. But we'll see. Like, I don't know. Generally, what I'm trying to say, I feel really demotivated at times. I have no idea how I am still pushing this. Yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you next stream.